So I've never played this game before, but a lot of people told me that they were excited to see me try. So that kind of inspired me to play it. Plus, it looks really good. Aye, that's how the sea is. She turns on you in the in, in the in the flip of a dime. The morning light fills your eyes. You try to sit upright. You're lying on the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers, disembarking them from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Gray Tomorrow. I must say, the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah, well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman is upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things onto our old vessels. We can catch up more and discuss details later. I'll let you get out of here and catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while getting your bearings right. Right my fuck straight. Whatever. You know what I was gonna say. Finally, I don't expose, uh, I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. They can really creep up on you. Doesn't need to be explained, huh? Move forward with L, and then reverse, and then turn with the same. Okay, so yeah, this is just the camera then. All right, cool. Oh, really? All right. I like that there's a bar that fills up whenever you have to like, they want you like, no, we need you to move the camera more just to make sure you have this. Move to a fishing spot, look for splashes on the surface, then press X to start fishing. All right, what do we got? Disturbed water, stock, high. Coastal. Not bad for the fishing mechanic. I like how you can just rotate stuff in your inventory. You have to fit everything. It's kind of funny. Oh, I got a trophy fish. Sick. Okay, we've depleted the stock, so let's go find... Oh, there's plenty. Okay, okay, this is good. Alright, what time is it? It's 10 a.m.? Oh, we're so good for today. Oh, you can... Oh, that's fun. That's how you turn on the lights. I wonder if the lights actually matter, though. Oh, no. The cod. What are we gonna do? I like how this is kind of like part Tetris in a way. It's shallow. You don't have the right equipment for this spot. 
All right, so we have to go to where the drop off is, I guess. I don't think that I can, uh, I don't think I can fit a one, a one space fish. So let's go ahead and head back. Shoot. Did they say what time the fog rolled in at? They said it was like sunset, but it couldn't be like, like, you know, it couldn't be like 5 PM where that rolls in. I don't get it. Also, my TV is cutting off some of the details. I need to figure out how I can adjust the screen cropping, but I think I'd have to like fully exit out of this to do it. Oh, it's funny. It says dock, but I can't even see what button it's for. Uh, triangle. No. Circle. Fuck. L1. L2. No. What's the docking button? Hang on. I guess I gotta figure this out. Let me just look on my OBS. My OBS will show me. It's, yeah, it's X. Okay, you just have to hold X. Dear God. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can fix the cropping on this TV real quick. Or, no, that wouldn't be like in the PlayStation settings, would it? There we go, that's much better. Now, oh shit, I accidentally backed out a little too far. But now I can see essentially what y'all see, as opposed to like... I don't know, I guess the best way to put it is... You see where it says resume, and then my, my head is there? Yeah, that's just... that's just not... not visible. I could see like the D in dock, and that was about it. You step onto the dock at Greater Morrow. The mayor is waiting nearby. Ah, I see you returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off into the town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, more than happy to sell you that replacement vessel. Yours to own. I understand you might not necessarily have the funds on hand, so we'll consider it a loan. I want to make this one easy for you. Uh, you sound a lot like Tom Nook right now. Until your debts are paid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. Small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you need to fish the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn, keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Where do I sell the fish? 
Hmm. Our local fishmonger will appraise the purchase you catch. He's open all hours. Off you go then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. I got 50 whole dollars to pay back on my boat. They're gouging me here. You enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. A familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around a, a downcast man behind the counter. You're the new fisherman, huh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway... Down to business. I'll pay for your fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Same species are worth more, too, or some. Other towns on other islands might pay you different, but while you got a debt outstanding here, I suggest you work on paying it off first. So let's see what you got. Oh, good, I can just sell all the fish. Okay, so we had storage. I wonder if the storage is just here or if the storage is like on the boat because I figured this was all we had. And it also says damage. I don't know if we can fix the damage at the fishmongers. I doubt it though. The mayor is standing outside the fishmonger store. He's basically Tom Nook, basically, honey. Excellent work. Oh, fuck, I just really occurred to me. I think I've been giving them the same voice. I'll try to make the other guy more like gruff and haggard. We'll get well, we'll see how that works. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here. I found this down by the ducks. Not sure if someone like you can make something of it. Why don't you take it? What is this? Research part. Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. As you walk into the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks at you briefly before turning back to her work. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not the business type. Uh, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payments up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also. If you take any damage from rocks, or any damage at all, I can patch it up. Mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hole she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden branches, all well above waterline, or boards, are splintered and scratched. Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. Weighted line. Simple skimmer. Oh, it's for shallow pools. Okay, so I wonder if the deck, the storage is on the deck because this would be pretty sick to just be able to throw on there. $150? Okay, they definitely want us to buy the skimmer then. Yeah, might as well keep it vertical. Or wait, no, 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 no. I'm going to do it horizontal because then I can stack the two big fish this way. Yeah, I got to think about how I'm going to stack these things in here. Okay, so that took two hours. It's 1047 p.m. Oh, good. I don't know if we even need to sleep, really. Okay, uninstall, discard, and sell. Is there not a way for me to move it? What is this? Curious looking component could be used to develop new equipment. Would need some investigation at the dock first. So we have to go back in order to actually. Okay, so we can't do anything with that right now. I wish I could take this and shove it over here. Uh, I don't think the side matters. I think it's just equipped or not. They just give you like so many slots to do it. Oh, hey, I've already paid off half my boat. Sick. Oh, this is where we research. 
Okay, a hydraulic rod. Spend one gear to research. Or a flexible fishing pole, coastal and shallow. And we only have one research part, but they clearly want us to do the hydraulic rod. Actually, I think we have to. to I think we have to do this to get to this. <coughs> Yeah, this one just has like two gears on it. You see underneath it? But it says it only spends one of them. Unless, unless it like just takes it away. Uh. <sighs> That's what I was afraid of. That's what I was afraid of. That does suck. I, I was genuinely wondering if that's going to be what it was. Improved outboard engine probably would have been a banger of an idea. Flexible fishing pole. You know what? Depending on how fast I can get research parts for, it might not be that big of a deal. Okay, so storage. So I guess uninstall. No, 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 no. Okay. Ooh. I guess if I like have time in the day to come back and to deposit fish or something and they'll be less fresh by the time I get back. But I think that might be how I can pull some of this off, like with going and getting multiple types of a uh, fish. Oh, let me get you your, your volume here. Oh, was I just that quiet the whole time? No, 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 no. You were turned down, so I didn't trigger your mic. Okay, say one more thing. Testing, testing. Yeah, that's probably all right. I do wish we could set it up to where I don't trigger the PNG tuber. Uh, yeah, yeah, it would be nice to set it up that way, but uh, <gasps> what was it? We would we would have to figure out a way to reroute your mic. Yeah. All right, so we don't have any messages or anything, so let's just go ahead and... I mean, it's 10 p.m. Oh, we can sleep. Let's go ahead and do that then. Yeah, I think the fucky stuff happens at night, usually. Well, I imagine. They told me to come back before dawn. Mm -hmm. I mean, dark, I mean. All right, here we go. This game is gorgeous. I love the, the reflections in the water. They did so good with those. All right, this one was a coastal, so we should be able to use our skimmer now. What's up, buoy? What's with the buoy? Floating buoy, it serves to mark safe passage past dangerous rocks and obstructed hazards. It's a dim light that also provides brief respite from the gloom of the night. Oh, oh. gotcha, so it's like that. Oh shit, I missed. That's my first miss. Alright. Oh, that's big. It's a big chungus right there. Alright, what do we... Okay, let's just go back and do more. I hope they're worth something, because, like, for all the space they're taking up, that means that the bigger fish were definitely, like, more worth it. I mean, it's, it's a square, too, so rotating it doesn't do much. Okay. We'll hope we can get more of those little... bendy boys. It looks like it's all going to be these. No, the stock is low. Oh. Like if you see where it says uh, the disturbed water underneath, it yeah. says stock low. So we got to like we could uh, fish it out completely, but we need different shapes of fish. I think these are going to be the bendy fish. What the hell? Okay, that's a different one. Okay, let's try over here. I don't think we have what we need necessarily. I think the fish that we've got the first time just aren't here right now. 
Oh, it's a little guy. Yeah, he's a little guy, but we don't have the space for a lot. So we'll just have to rush back and hope that we can get more fish in before it's too late. Yeah. You could fit one more of those. Uh, oh yeah, you're right, I could. Hit that bang for your book, baby. As far as I know, I don't think there's a way to go any faster either. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm. I assume that's just like future engines. The fastest my little tugboat can go. I'm glad I managed to figure out how to set the TV back to audio uh, auto aspect ratio because <laughs> it. Uh, I remember I had to change it because of the switch, right? Yeah. And so I went and I looked at it, and you see the D on dock. That's where it cut off. So oh. I didn't know what button it was to dock the boat. <laughs> And I kept hitting buttons, but you have to hold X. Alright, fishmonger. I've had a special come through from a customer. If you can suspend- Oh, wait, a special order, oh, okay. If you could- f I'm so good at reading. Fulfill. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above normal prices. Tell me about the order. They asked for one gold flounder and one gray eel. Oh. Just bring them down when you have them. You don't need to have that rod that can handle shallow water in order to catch those. Shipwright might be able to sort that out for you. Have you got any fish for that order? I do. Just leave whatever you got here. I'll keep the order on the ice until it's ready to go. That's lucky. Gray eel. It's definitely like a tutorial thing for sure, for sure. Yeah. All right, gray eel, and then they wanted flounder. The flounder. <laughs> what the hell? No. What was that? I'd go check. It almost sounded like someone tried opening our door. I think someone just slammed their door and that's it. Babe, is it good? What was it? Oh, okay. The fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. Good, good. Then you should be pleased with these. I got another order here. This... This one's a little more curious. I want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. I don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night. And well, you know what nights are like around here. Good luck. I don't. I actually don't know what the nights are like around here. If anything, oh, I have enough. Okay, I'm going to the ship, right? I don't care if it takes a couple days. As far as I know, there's no time that I'm under here. Yes. Okay. The weird shape of this fishing rod, I think, is going to be what gets me kind of fucked off about it. And, like, we have the simple skimmer. And this is just a better shallow line. So I think we're going to do... Rusty upward engine. And then cracked bulbs. Oh my god, our lighting is fucking cracked. It would be. Wait, we, oh, we can buy a second outboard yeah. motor. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. So we can't... Oh, these are for us to... Okay, See, those are the cracked get. ones. What are the other ones? Cloudy, Cloudy lens. lens. So they're probably just, like, not as they're good. They're slightly better. It's the... They're, look, you can see the yeah. lumens. Yeah. So as of right now, we have no lights with quotes, but we totally do. Yeah. Um... Okay, there's no repairs to be made because we haven't crashed the boat. A second outboard engine might be what we need. So we have shallow and moderate fishing rods... Mm -hmm. And as much as I would like to get the simple skimmer upgraded, we just... What was it? Yeah, because like installing this, we get $30 from it. Yeah. And then we'd be at 200 And then we'd have $50 left over after we bought the weighted line. Which it does give you 40% fishing speed, but we didn't really... 
It's really been it's, it's been all right so far. I think so that's we'll something do. to worry about later. Outboard motor time, baby. Oh yeah, that's right. All right, how much does this? Can we not sell this? We can only uninstall it. Well, we'll do that when we actually have the money for the second outboard motor. All right. Uh. Um, I would actually see if you can purchase and install a light first. Because, like, you really don't produce light. Like, I don't think it's enough to prevent creatures. Let's just, let's just try to go to this one thing right here. Think we'll be okay for right now. Mm -hmm. But the customer wants black grouper and squid. And the thing about it is, I know the squid won't be a problem, but I think the black grouper is gonna be further out. What's that eye? What is that eye? Uh, is something looking at me? Probably. I don't like that. Yeah. Should I turn it off? I don't think that lights off is good. Cause like, uh, being near the buoys is supposed to like, protect you a little, I think. But I don't really know. Exposure to fog and other things increases your panic. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. The lighthouse towers above. Waves crash endlessly against the uh, perilous rocks below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken if thrown at its feet. You ponder the intrinsic power of this vast structure. Oh, the structure. Vast column of stones shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long until it decays to ruin, its purpose exhausted? The lighthouse towers above. Okay. Okay, so I think the eyeball is your panic. Oh, sh- I just fucking damaged my goddamn hole. Yeah. So does panic mean I'm panicking a lot? Like, does that mean I I'm don't panicking a lot? I think so. I don't know what it changes to, though. That's not sick. What? My light just dimmed out. Oh. Okay, now it's getting foggy as shit. Yeah. Oh, there's your panic. See that little thing up there? Gotcha, so I'm leaving. Yeah. Oh. Did you see that? Yeah, you can't see the rocks until you're right up on them. That's, that's what that is. That's fucked up. That's probably why you want a light. No, oh, of course. Are you the harbinger? <laughs> that's definitely a harbinger right there. A hunched old woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Oh. Why are you here? I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. You have any fish for that order? Yeah. Just leave what you have. Keep the order on ice until it's ready to go. All right, come back when you have everything. Now, on a regular business, eh? Oh, I know what that X is. What? That's damage to your hull. That's the damage. Okay, well, we're good for now, mm -hmm. then. But, like, that's not great. Um, I bet you it's going to be way more expensive to fix. With the way those X's in the box mean, uh, I assume you can only take damage three times Repairing before all of it's $30. I mean, you can... You could afford it, but you could also just buy a light. Well, we can't now. Oh, are they? Oh, they are all like a hundred dollars. Also, it's or more. three a.m., so it's about to be basically daytime. You should sleep anyway. Otherwise, your panic's gonna keep keep up. All right. I don't think we can catch any grouper, but we're just gonna try to focus. I want to try to make two trips today if I can. Mm -hmm. Completed. Okay. 
That looks like flounder again. Yeah, they're also really low. Okay, getting the ship to go slightly faster, definitely the move. Mm -hmm. Eels. It sucks you can't stack. Y yeah, but I think that's just part of the strategy. Oh, that's, I think, what we're looking for right there, baby. Holes? I think that's the grouper. I think the squid were the only things that come out at night. Oceanic. We don't have the equipment for that? Damn. I don't think they would give you something that you don't have so early. Uh, that's what we just did with the shallow. Oh. Yeah. I mean, though, like, with the... with the grouper. It might just be somewhere that we aren't... A Check that out. Oh, you don't have a dredge. What the shit? That's the name of the game! Ooh, that's it's probably, the dredge! That's probably how you get, uh, the learning... little schematic things. It's possible. All right, let's see what we got here. There, that's what I was looking for last time. Time passes really quickly. Time does pass pretty quickly. Oh wait, do rocks just spontaneously appear at night? That was weird. Nah, there it's gotta be a... There think... are rocks there like basically in the middle of the thing. Maybe that'd well, be so crazy before. if they did though. Have you seen the strange red light at night? Seems to have been rising from the west. I hate the flies buzzing around because it makes me want to swat at the TV. Yeah, the, I thought flies, there was a the flies there. do look like it's actual in real life. Um, One of the things that kind of bothers me a bit is where's my order? There's no way it's already like past time. I don't know. The I think is, it's... Uh -huh. It's probably one of those things that it doesn't show you the order unless you got shit for it. Oh, probably. I was gonna say, because I just need that one grouper or whatever. Mm -hmm. The mayor is walking towards you. He seems to be in a good mood with a spring to his, with a spring in his step. <clears throat> Fantastic news. Thanks partly to your efforts, Greater Marrow is growing. Haha, <laughs> better than you. It's <laughs> better than you. No. Our town will be swarming with visitors any day now. In I'm fact, I've granted consent uh, for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also reallocated some money to improve in fishmonger services. He might have something to talk to you about sometime soon. By the way, hmm. a politician actually doing what he says he's going to do. He's crazy. Elect him. I mean, small town politicians, they got to do what they're, they said they're going to do. Otherwise, they get, like, thrown into the water. That's true. That's true. Yeah, they'll just throw him off the lighthouse. Yeah. Keep up the good work. <clears throat> Hold on. Keep up the good work. When we've chosen... Oh, wait. We're, fuck. We're glad we've chosen to be here with us. Uh. Oh, repair mode's active. Uh, Okay, there we go. I'm not used to it being called R2. Hmm. Yay, light bulb. Expensive ass light bulb. For real. All right. Well, we oh. got all that. Oh. Shh, huh? At least games like this don't make you like pay for your cost of living and like food and shit like that. Oh my that. god, yeah. You can just terrible. like do whatever you want. Dry dock. This is the dry dock. We can make significant improvements to your vessel here. 
We're talking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior hulls. We need a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal, scraps, that sort of things. How do I get materials? There's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks and the like. You'll find a way to get at them. Materials assigned towards upgrades will here will be stored here, so don't worry if you only have half of what is needed. Thank God. I don't have any of this shit. Mm -mm. I think uh, you got to get that net tool. Net tool? Yeah. Ah. I don't think it's available. Wait, go to the right. Again. Yeah, you don't have any yet. No trawling nets. Yeah. See, it's 8 p.m. You got a thing from the mayor again. Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow? <laughs> <laughs> That's me. Milo, the middle child of three islands. <laughs> Would you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Didn't realize I was a charity giver. The mayor hands you a small damp package. Great. Bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I do not want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. It is a fucking nighttime now, so I have to go. I mean, you could go to sleep now instead. No, because it's it's time based. It's oh, gonna it is spoil time based. It. Yeah, they said it's gonna spoil. I'm sure this is the first thing we're supposed to do to scare the piss out of us. Yeah. Is that is it not that big building over there? It might be. Oh. I saw the sparkly and I went, I gotta risk it. Risk it for the biscuit. Your panic doesn't seem to be too high right now though. <laughs> hmm? What? A delivery? Let's see here. He tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. Inside, you can't say what sure, but he's feeling as though he's shielding it from your view. Yeah, nice and fresh. <clears throat> This'll do nicely. Uh, I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. I was given this old book a few weeks back. Didn't make much sense to me. I'm sure you'll get some use out of it. He pulls a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of pages are folded over. <clears throat> Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you could read it while out on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. You enter a brightly lit shop. It's stacked with antiques. The shelves are full of jewelry and other ba baubles. A man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello? Is that... Uh, no. I don't believe we've met. Forgive me. My eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice on you today, perhaps? No. No. So they buy your random garbage. See, my insanity is growing. I actually think that's just the dawn coming. You think it's the dawn? Yeah. I don't really know how to tell how insane you are. Oh, it's changing colors. See, that's kind of what I was worried about. I just, I don't know what the colors mean. That we're looking for right there? Yeesh. 
I think so. That's hey. what we need, baby. This will be. We only have room for like one, so thank God that's all they need. Yeah, you're right. It is the. I think. No, I think it is. Yeah, it's just daylight now. Yeah, it is. No, it's daylight, but also it's just weird about the paranoia. Maybe the color the. Oh. oh. That's the paranoia setting in. I think that's the paranoia. Oh. Arrow squid lost to birds. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. We're too insane. Arrow squid lost to birds. Fishmonger, quick. I didn't think you had it in you. Night fishing's a tall order. Been meaning to talk to you about a new business venture. I've been considering crab pots. Got one for here for you. In fact, it's a bit banged up, but you could get it fixed at the ship, right? Should be pretty straightforward. Just drop it out at sea anywhere and come back after a day or two and check on it. I got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both species found around here. Also, now you can buy uh, crab thingies. Lousy weather lately. Almost makes you not want to get out of bed. And you and I gotta do it, eh? We're what keeps people from going hungry. Not buying anymore right now. Oh, you can sell those other things, though. Oh, right. Hmm. Yay. Yeah. All right. Repair all for seven dollars, and then we got a hundred and fifty. So let's go ahead and buy that second outboard motor. Wait. I think your other random one is better. It is better. Gotcha. I think you need to repair that equipment. No, it's not broken. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, nothing's broken. Um, okay, we have the simple skimmer, weighted line. We might as well just install that. We got to get rid of the simple skimmer first. So. Oh. Are you sure? Yeah. Because like she says it is, and the dude said it was. Said what was? That that's broken. That's why he gave it to you for free. A crab trap? Oh, yeah. right, it is broken. I had forgotten about that. But it says, well, fix no, it? we already fixed it because we oh, did you repair it. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. That's what had happened. Okay, she should be. She should hopefully have only one skimmer by the end of this. So, yeah, we got the regular. We have coastal rod, and then we have. Shallow rod with better efficiency. <laughs> okay. I think that's gonna be good. Uh should we should we sleep to get rid of the creepy eye? I don't know, because I don't really know, like, at what level you become, like, insane, insane. Like, what? Well, see, the eye's gone now. Yeah, the eye's gone now, but, like, it changes colors and stuff, and I don't know what the colors mean. I'm guessing that's, like, what just what happens yeah. in, like, uh, like, various insane events. Like, the color might say what's going on. Yeah. L1. Oh, yeah, you throw the crab pot out at some point. And then deploy it with... I know that it's saying there's like plenty of crab and stuff. Mm -hmm. But is it like one of them's like really fucking. Oh. Okay, you know what? Just to keep it. Let's try to keep it like right here. Alright.
What the shit? What was that? Time for you to go back. That's what that is. You think so? Yeah. But what was it? Mm -hmm. A spooky noise. A spooky a noise. Spooky. And it's something, something in the water. There's something in the water. Oh, what a good song. Alright. Found this book out back. Could be useful to you. Fishmonger reaches under the counter and hands you a damp, battered book. A few shimmering fish scales are stuck to the cover. Thanks. Looks like we have everything the shipwright has right now. Yeah. Unless we go to the dry dog. You don't have any garbage. Which is funny, because like, how are we supposed to get garbage? I don't know. I feel like we were supposed to put the research part on yeah, this. Yeah, but you can't now, so. Right, like how are we supposed to deal with that? There has and to like, be another way to And like, since you can't them. take it back off, back off, they have to assume that like someone would make that mistake. Oh my God, you'd fucking hope they'd assume that like yeah. thing. By the way, do you want to give it a shot? No. You don't? No. Why not? I mean, eh. You don't want to do any fishing? I don't want to do any fishing, I'm chilling. Unless you're just wanting to get up. I mean, I was gonna do that, but like, <laughs> I wasn't gonna just like, you know, like I can pause it. It's no big deal. <laughs> I just know that you were excited about me playing it, so I didn't know if you wanted a shot. You got a fucked up fish now. Yay. What the fuck? Yay, you got a fucked up fish. Why'd they give me a fish with Down syndrome? What the shit? That's crazy. It's a grotesque mackerel. You can't get that fish. Ocean. Right. Looks like you can go further out though. I think there were some more shallows. Before we go over that, oh, that's right. We can't get that because no yeah. trawling net. To your left, that one out there in the deep water, you definitely can't get. I genuinely didn't think that they could give me like actually fucked up fish. Dredge. Shapes. Oh, it's a dredge. Every time we say the word dredge, I think of the dredge from Dead by Daylight. Every time we say dredge, I just think of this game. What that? I don't know what this is. A slab of rock just from the water, bearing crude symbols of curved fish. Oh my god! It's oh, don't put that there. Why not? It's not the right. You curved fish, baby. You need to put cod there. I think you need to fill it with cod. Besides, you need to give that to the fishmonger or somebody. Okay. Oh, right. Because they asked you for fucked up they fish. They asked me for fucked up fish. I forgot that they actually directly asked me for that. I see wood over there. I wonder if you could just pick it up off the coast. That's what I'm wondering. Hmm. 
I'm curious why you don't rotate the fish. Uh, can you not rotate the fish? You can. It just depends on, like... Depends on, like, if you really have a place to put them. All that's left of this boat is an old husk. You pull a little closer, look inside. Yay, you got some garbage and a research part. Okay, we need the wood though, so... <laughs> yeah. I don't know what to do about this. Um... Um... I think... I guess I'm just gonna have to come back. Yeah, you're just gonna have to come back. I'm not gonna try to thread that needle, I'm just gonna go around the island. What's that? The stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes dance across its surface, vanishing before your eyes can focus on them. Cold stone does not respond to your touch. Okay, so you gotta have something first. Um... Why is that water glowing? I don't know. Ooh, another fucked up fish. Just swap it out for another one. Oh sh! It got so dark so quickly. Yeah, it did. I guess as the night falls, the water glows, letting you know there's fucked up fish there. The rocks. Fucking yikes. Glad my lights decided to come back. Yeah. Huge day out at sea. Massive, even. Yeah. What is it today? You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish to his face for inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Uh. Ah, this is the sort of specimen to liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. He runs a finger firmly along the length of the fish. Sheesh! Uh, as though feeling for something. He then pushes... <laughs> is that a carp in your pocket? Are you happy to see right. me? He pushes... Uh, fuck, what? Hang Push. on. He pushes from one side of its stomach to a small shape that can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open, and from its stomach, a small piece of fabric that spreads it onto a counter. It's definitely a patterned handkerchief. Well, I've never seen that before in my days. I'll give you this thing, and I'll pay you for the fish too, of course. This is a really good guy. It's not the first fish corrupted I've seen around these parts. I'm sure you'll find more like it for too long. I'll pay you well if you find more. Glad we kept it then. Yeah. Let's uh, go sell all these fish. Good. Handkerchief. I wonder what we're going to do with that. I don't know. Okay, well, let's go get the research thing done, and then we'll go get the jewelry... Yeah, you can go sell the jewelry to the, uh, Little Marrow or whatever it was. Wait, did I just buy a fucking crab trap? You did. God damn it. Guess I'll buy a fucking crab trap. The man is looking at you through the cabin window, or through your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you... Oh, I know what took you to the fish... Wait, okay, hang on. I know, I know what, you, what you took to the fishmonger. Okay. I know what you took to the fishmonger. And I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it. But not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. 
I guess that's where you sell your weird garbage. From. Yep, that's my weird garbage guy. Except for the other weird garbage guy on Little Marrow. Yeah. Well, good news is we'll get uh, most of what we need for. Yeah, you'll get some wood, some but this. you won't be able to get any of screws yet, I think. Where do I give her my upgrade part? Um, you do that in your own pockets, I think. Not unless it's the light bulb, but I think that's just the lights. Yeah, back out and go to your own like brain pockets or whatever. Research. That's right. Yeah. Okay. Damn. So you can either get that or you can get. Uh, I mean, at this point, I might as well. I think you should probably get the oceanic first, honestly. This? Yeah, because you haven't been able to dig. You haven't been able to get any of the ocean fish yet. Right. All right, so now you can buy that. Oh my god, it's massive. Yeah. God. <laughs> and fucking expensive, holy shit. $400? Oh my god, I regret ever listening. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> so, we'll keep this up here. Uh-huh. So we don't forget. We'll go drop the crab trap and then head over to see the bozo on the other island. And we shouldn't need to sleep. Oh. Yeah. You think maybe we just become insane and like that's what's going on? Yeah, because I don't think that most of those rocks were there before, right? Nah, it's definitely like us hallucinating. Collect that freaky fish. Yo, catch that freak fish. It's oh, just it's a, a regular, regular fish. fish. <laughs> I like how we're both disappointed. It's like, oh, it didn't even look like that. Oh, there oh, we there's go. there's a freaky one. But the other dude's on Blackstone Island. Yeah, he's south. Yeah. We're, we're going to this guy first because we know that this guy can do our trinkets. Yeah. All right. Uh, I guess just sell. I guess mm -hmm. that's all we're doing. Oh, wait. Sell all trinkets. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Trinkets sold. You should probably sleep there first. Something slithers into your cargo hold. Well. That's not great. Oh, I think that fish is infected now. The regular one that you caught earlier. Oh my god, no way it is. It what is, the it's sh infected! What is wrong with it? I uh -huh. A short stocky fish with a model black. Okay, it doesn't say anything else about it. I like how you're like really stoked like and you can clearly hear it. it's like you're so excited that it's fucked up and I'm, I'm like what's wrong with up. this fish and you're like oh my god what's wrong with this fish but like in a positive way OMG Does dredge yes we're playing dredge bob and we've seen only hallucinations so far so nothing like that scary really okay we'll come back to that let's get some like less big fish on the way home You need a bunch of cod, the but I, don't, I actually don't even know if you can store as many cod as you need to solve that puzzle. True. Also, the sound design in this game is so good. It is. But I'm pretty sure if we just leave the cod in the thing, it'll be okay. Oh, I guess those rocks were always there. Okay, hang on. Let's go do that while it's daytime. It's over there. Um, Milo. No. Check your DMs according to Bob. And of course. Oh, okay. But yeah, also, how's your name been, Bob? It's good to see you. We are we are chugging along as good as we can right now. I mean, it's, uh, it's been all right. Freshly clean at home. Oh, that must feel nice, especially after how long you spent <laughs> down here. 
I mean, goodness gracious. One of the things I'm happy for is with, uh, I, m I miss everyone already, right? But the house is like three degrees cooler without all the body heat. So I have pajama pants on. <laughs> Wait, was that the place we had to go put the... Or yeah. was it back here? Uh, it's back over there to your... Back over this way? way? Yeah. somewhere where you can fit it's, like, it's this more. way and it's gonna be this three this mm -hmm. three and then this three so we need three more i don't the cod altar goes so hard <laughs> like you can see the fish altar on top to of it cod. no a what? stench is coming from the cargo hold oh no oh my god no it's infecting the other fish quickly grab the wood so we can leave No wonder people will cut that gap sometimes. Yeah. Like, I've never... I've only seen one clip of this game ever, and I still hadn't seen anything in the game. It was just somebody piloting their boat really fast out of fear, but I couldn't see from what. And they cut that gap back there. But I was like, why would you do that if it just hurts your boat? But if they're running from something, I imagine there's a reason. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it was, though. It just seemed like they were scared. I wonder how you're supposed to get in there. Pile of loose debris. Clearing this would take some strong explosives. Oh, okay. Dino Mite. I wish it explained what level of insanity the eyeball meant. Yeah. Because I think, like, as the pupil becomes more slit like, you're more insane. But I don't know. Because I think it starts blue. Yeah. More uh, garbage. You can't get it. If you need glue, Milo, hit me up. I'll have some shit to your house. Oh, nice. <laughs> also, uh, let's see. So love the PNG tuber. Must say again. Oh, thank you. I wish we had a way to get Milo her own little representative. You know what it is? It would be completely possible if, if she was on her own PC. But she's oh, not. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We could make a two-headed PNG tuber whenever I'm in the room. <laughs> no, because it's the same mic source still. I know. So it just would, st both the mics would just be yeah. doing it all the time. A Hydra. Yeah, except uh, one of them is good at gaming and the other one is terrible. One lies and the other tells the truth. Fisherman, have you run into a photographer on your travels? She's docked here a few days ago for supplies. I suggested that she take some pictures of the town for promotional purposes, but she didn't seem too interested. She mentioned she was heading south. Perhaps you should introduce yourself. Why do you care? <sighs> Alright, so now we're gonna go south to get rid of the handkerchief. Mm -hmm. And then let's do the lumber at the dry dock. Maybe you put it in your storage. No, nah, she said she'll hold on to stuff. Yeah.
Yeah, you know what? We'll do storage just in case I need something. Like later, yeah, like, like you specific. might change your mind. Because I don't know if we can go and get back out of the upgrade. Right. The real thing that's going to suck is I have nowhere to put this thing. <laughs> right, let's take a nappy and then go uh, go south. Hey, quit being insane, baby, and then go see that strange man. <laughs> they do keep talking about that red glow. I assume you're supposed to go fuck with it at some point. Yeah, he says it's like out to the west or something. Yeah. Like it's kind of behind the... Uh, the town. Grieb! Did you get them? Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. We're gonna do a quick day of fishing because I need to give what's it called the the fisher guy. I need mm -hmm. to give him those crabs. But you oh. can go put that cod on the altar. Yeah, biggest thing. I was hoping we could find another school of cod. Yeah. You know what? Mm. I'm shooting the gap. Yeah, see if you can. It's probably not that hard. I bet you it is whenever you're like in a hurry. Oh yeah. Once you like have the speed up and stuff like that. Yeah, well like also for lack of better words, it do be very boaty. Yeah. Eels, I think? Eels. You know, the island that one guy's on, mm -hmm. it probably wouldn't be so hard to get to as long as it's got, like, I don't know, lights? Yeah. I guess would be, like, the best way to put it. Let's see. South. Oh, that's got to be it right there. Mm-hmm. Wait. That's north. Bold of me to assume that the island we spawned on was facing north. Ooh. What? You can't get it. What? Swordfish. Swordfish. Yeah. Squadfish. What is that? They fucking over there? Are those hearts? Uh, I don't think it's hearts. Oh, it's a shipwreck. It's a shipwreck, yeah. Damn it! Oh, there's the other island right there. Uh, I looked at the sanity eye if you want the rundown. Please, yes, please give it to me. I would like to know what I am dealing with here. I'm gonna say it right now. I don't, oh wait, is that it right there? I'm about to turn the fuck around. Oh, there's lights, I see lights. Foghorn? Sounded like one. 
I mean, it is foggy. Yeah, but I need the... Well, I guess the lights are staying on. Oh, yeah, we're getting fucking insane as hell. Or at least I assume that that's what it is. We'll see I what I assume Bob says. that that's what it is because, like, it's changed colors and now it's kind of flashing a little. Nah, fam, we still going. Makeshift dock? This isn't even the place? <laughs> uh, well, okay. Strange well, symbols are etched into the sand. We want to do inspect the symbols. The symbols span the breadth? Mm -hmm. What's that? Uh, it's like the, the si like the whole size. Oh, okay. The size of the camp. Twisting its way. This way and that. Some are grouped together. It must be words. Fresh footprints are... Carefully around each symbol, the last symbol trails off, and Hurley looks unfinished. Well, give us that. Barefoot, large and wide, perhaps indicating that they were left by a man, but you don't know much about footprints. Fresh footprints... I already got both of those, so go back. Mm -hmm. What do you want to do? Search the, the campsite. Yeah, search the campsite. An extremely rough and worn sheet of fabric is collapsed at the base of the wooden uh, supports. There is nothing remarkable about it. Okay. Take a nap, though. So do you have to go further south? That's my best guess. Do we have like a little map of like... No. No map, okay. No, the only thing is that he said that Black Rock or whatever it's called mm -hmm. is to the south. Well, the south. Like yeah, but ocean. like, do you see anything? And he yeah. said to the south of like our original location. Yeah. I don't see any more islands over there. I'm kind of nervous. Hmm. I think it must be over here somewhere. I mean, like, that's some black rocks. Oh, shoot. Can you read what Bob said? Yeah. Oh. yeah. Well, hang on, hang on, honey. Sorry. Don't get too close. There's... Well, God damn it. You're tangling me in the microphone, and you're gonna... You're, you're so close to the mics, you're just gonna... Like, we're both... Like, hang on. Oh, you have a There's a mic over well. here. I have a raid. Whoa, wait, what? Oh my gosh, Morgan! How are you? I don't have my headphones on right now. I'm sorry I didn't hear anything. Oh my gosh, it's a plushy raid. How is everybody? I hope you guys are doing good. Oh my god, okay, it's a whale. It's okay, it's a whale. <laughs> I was so worried as to whatever the hell that could be. Oh my goodness, but anyways, how was your stream, Morgan? How, like, what'd you guys do? Yeah, we're doing some dredge right now. Uh, Carol Con's over, so we're we're just hanging out, kind of in recovery mode. We're supposed to be going to a place called Black Rock. What the hell is that? I don't know if I trust that. Yeah, I would keep going. I would uh not slow down. Okay, that's a Black Rock though. Yeah, and there's like some kind of factory shit. Some sort of civilization, stuff. that's all that yeah. matters. Okay, so Bob says, this all pertains to not being landed at and at sleeping, so start ending at 6 p.m. Weird shit can start happening, hence why you get the weird colors, sticks, but no eyeball. Blue eyeball is it's starting to get late and spooky out, but uh, then if 
you stay out, the eye might turn green, and it means we're getting in there. It's not <laughs> yet quite that bad, but you should not be seeing eyeballs in the first place. Now, would you uh, quote from the thing? Brown is the last warning that you need to find a port to sleep. Gotcha. So brown is what we were just at that. Oh, there's more. Uh, red means panic. It means that you are entirely entitled to freak the fuck out. Uh, could mean game over, but no, the red eye also has stages. You're not entirely lost if the eye turns red. What you will get is things obstructing your view, so you will not be able to spot safe spaces as easily or anything, in fact. The more deeper you go, the more weird it gets, like distorted vision and dozens of red eyes popping in and out of your view. This is the spot where external influence, uh, like your skill and the location you're in might have some sway. So depending on where you are, you might be okay or absolutely screwed. Unless something is following you, but common sense says get the fuck out. Okay. It's that's more of funny. a panic meter than a sanity meter. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay, well, that's fun. Um, ah. We got a resident. Do you need yeah. help with anything? Oh gosh. Where can I, uh, yeah. I've been trying to prepare a special mirror for my partner, but I have been having some issues. Around here, we consider aged conger eels to be a particular delicacy. You might say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. Normally, we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature, but our dog keeps digging them up and eating them. I can't raise the subject without spoiling the surprise. Uh, can you bring me some aged... Yeah, sure. Whatever. Let's see, uh, where can I catch it? Ah, uh, yes, they're tricky to find inhabitants of holes, burrows within cliffs. Interesting. Uh, imagine they've been fished out around the edges, so you may have to venture into passageways of the cliffs to find them. Mm, and did I mention they only come out at night? Of course. Why wouldn't yeah. they do anything else? Let's see, where can I sell my fish? We catch fish ourselves here. We don't really have the need for buying any. But there's a merchant that travels around. She's usually anchored across the bay. She buys and sells almost anything. She does repairs, too. How convenient. Right. Hmm. Do you have any odd character around these parts? Are you talking about the tale of Magran? He was an old whaler from these parts. As the whales got more scarce, the crew spent longer and longer at sea trying to find them. Margin, Margrin, it seems, wasn't cut out for this. He formed an unnatural attachment to a scroll he found on one of his trips. He says the scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish. People started calling him Magron the Fisherman. Or Fishman. Fishman! Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. One day the town awoke to find all the boats, nets, and lines had been slashed in the night, and old Magron was nowhere to be found, nor has he been seen since. Anything else? Hmm... Many years ago, the cliffs used to be a haven for smugglers and pirates. Legend tells that two pirate lords who used Gale Cliff as their hideout. Supposedly, they got into some disagreement and a huge battle was fought on the south side of the cliffs. There was certainly a large number of wrecks in that area. Both sides were completely destroyed. Their treasure hoards left abandoned and unclaimed to this day. I dare say they'd be worth a lot if anyone knew where to find them. Thank you, exposition lady. <laughs> right, we really appreciate your exposition. Oh, there's more town right there. Yeah. I guess that's the traitor. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. No! Oh, I have to hit A. Duh. I'm stupid. Ahoy there! You're a new face, fisherman, I take it. Perfect! Well, we should get along like a house on fire. What? <laughs> you never heard that saying before? Nope. I'm a traveler and a merchant. Yes, I already know about this. Okay, well, I do have some stuff to sell. Yep, equipment, blah, blah, blah. I already know. Someone already told me your whole gimmick. Oh, 
My crabs, they've all rotted. Oh no. They rot fast. Can you even sell the rot? Nope. Damn. She has everything that the other person has. That's kind of crazy. Ooh. What that? Refined metal. Expensive as hell. And a research part that is also expensive as hell. <laughs> Would have been affordable if, if we had crabs. Crab. <laughs> How do you ditch the rot? Oh, there you go. It's too bad you can't sell your ring to her. Right. Oh. Mm. oh. <laughs> Do you need anything? Assistance from an angler? Absolutely, I've been trying to collect records of where each species of fish is located. I figured out most of them by now. Uh, uh, Sorry. I figured out most of them on my travels so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track. Reckon you could help them out? Yeah, whatever. Oarfish, gulper, eel, goliath, tigerfish, and coelacanth. Of course! Literally, like, the rarest fish in most games, right. especially Animal Crossing. I would ask for directions, but I'm sure I will come across them. Let's go to that town real quick. I think we can't get to the rest of the town. Oh, it looks like it might be destroyed. Yeah. An old man emerges from one of the many broken buildings and homes and hobbles towards ah. you. Ah, greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What do you need? You know how I can clear the ah. debris? You probably need some explosives to shift those rocks. My brother Ingfell used to make explosives. For the whaling operations, you see, nasty stuff. When the whales are gone, or, or with the whales gone, well, the whales aren't gone. We saw one. Yeah. I can imagine, can't imagine he's still in business. What else do you need to know? Uh, why do you live here? I've been stubbornly holding out for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I have been happy here for very long. My wife and I, my... My wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Now I'm all alone, cut off by land and sea, left with only the trembling rocks on oh, with trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move to Ingfell. It's not that simple. My brother would never. You see, I used to live in Ingfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot, mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. We were in the prime of foolishness of our youth. When my uh, wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Where is it? That's the pro that is where the problem lies. After the collapse, that creature, it dragged debris from houses down to its wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's a lost cause, I know, but if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest. It would mean the world for me. I'll look for it. Thank you. But please, be careful. Well, potentially you can go s <laughs> go speak to uh, someone over in Ingfeld now and get the uh, explosives. I think they said Ingfeld was... Uh, what, over here? Yep. That's oh, it. oh, that's funny. Just across the water, literally. Yeah. Let's 
It sucks that these aren't the fish that I need. No. Oh, coin. <laughs> what is it, Tiny? We're in here. He like ran past and stopped in front of the door. Oh, that sucks. It's a perch. Oh, by the way, honey. Huh. I know you don't. I know you normally wouldn't care, but you have to see the new Mr. Beast video. Okay. Jaden Animations, isn't it? Oh, neat. I I don't want to spoil it. It's really good. And by good, I mean there's other people that I really feel like shouldn't have been there, but I don't want to say anything else. Otherwise, it'd be pointless to watch. Ah. Wait. Huh. Oh, it's over there. I was yeah. like, where's the place for me to sell all this? All right, hold on. I'll catch up with chat in just a second. I'm on my phone since we're playing on the uh, the PS4 or PS5. I mean, so I had to uh, had to make sure I was actually checking things. Let's see, pretty art. Yeah, honestly, the uh, what's it called? The game, this game particularly, it's very beautiful. I like it a lot. I'm surprised you've never heard we get along like a house on fire. Yeah, but like, like I do like fire. Fire is great, right? Don't get me wrong. It's a part of this brand. But I've never heard of somebody say getting along like a house on fire. How does that how does that imply that you are getting along? I feel like very parks are well. right now. No, no, it doesn't. It, it implies very well. No, I think I'd be preferring if my house wasn't on fire. You know what? I'm gonna buy that research part for 350. But no, uh, getting along like a house on flyer fire is a, a relationship uh, goes fast like you got along as fast as a house burns down so it's sarcastic kind of yeah okay that's it's like I'm... like they get along obviously but like you got along just as well as a house burns yeah. down so yeah so it's sarcastic yeah um okay so how much is this 460 dollars but it catches shallow and coastal fish 75 no i just spent i just spent it upgrading yeah, no, no, so like this is coastal, this is shallow, and I just researched this, this is both. Which, which, well, yeah, so get this. So look, see how this is three? I'm gonna put it on the right side, and then I'm gonna use the left side to put the deep sea, the, the, co the oceanic rod on. Yeah, so we just gotta go hella fishing. My dad's gonna be so proud of me. Thankfully, I don't think the days matter at all because it's day 10. Uh, could you pour a shot and then I'll come take a shot with you? Poggies. I guess I'm just gonna start catching as many fish as I can, hoping to make 400 bucks.
Uh, hey Milo, do you have a metal scrapey spatula or scraper tool? Milo, did you hear that? Do you have any sort of metal spatula or scraper tool? She says she can probably get one. A nat. What the fuck? A gnashing perch. It's a perch that's mostly teeth. <laughs> Ooh, a stonefish. Nice. Okay, well, I can't keep catching stonefish because I don't have the space for that. Oh, that's definitely dredging. That looks like solid materials. Yeah, it is. Hey, well, actually, he's allowed right here specifically. Hello, buddy. Did you want to come hang out? Oh, no! I scooted too fast! So... He, he knows better, thankfully, but he's been such a good boy about this. So, um, he'll get up on that part of the desk, and then if I turn the chair around and pat my lap, he'll sit in my lap. That is why I don't punish that behavior, because it ends with me and a cat in my lap. And life just does not get much better than that sometimes. <laughs> the music for this fishmonger. Oh, yeah, I might also just like really this good. fishmonger better because she girl. Same kind of glue used to spackle a wall. What the fuck is spackling? That sounds like it'd be a fetish thing. <laughs> Shit, I like someone to spackle me sometimes when I've been bad. Oh, no, like <laughs> Alright. Spackling aside, I'm gonna stand up, take a quick shot. Um, oh goodness. This game has been so much fun so far. Uh, I will say, I was expecting it to be scarier so far, but I also know that we haven't gotten as crazy as we could, and I also know that, I also know that the one, the one thing I've seen was five seconds of somebody driving a boat really fast through some narrow passageways and screaming at the top of their lungs. And so I know that I can never just let my guard down because <laughs> yeah. that that is the temperature that somebody has set this game for me. <laughs> no, I think that's definitely something that once you get the the fa ability to be fast boat, that sh shit like that starts happening. Like you start getting chased and stuff. See, that's well, don't. Well, OK, I mean, uh, you know what? I don't I, I would say I was like, well, don't spoil it. But I mean, th they were clearly running. They I were mean, clearly you running. Are, you already know they were clearly running well, away. You from run something. for two reasons yeah. to get away from something or for sport. And yeah. it didn't look like they were doing it to have a good time because they were screaming. <laughs> <laughs> you don't see people running track. Just go. Ah! Ah! Like, well, they're fucking. <laughs> OK, but can we? Can we do that? What? It's a relay race, but one of you's but dressed you up like Scream. One of you dressed up like Scream because they're chill with the IP, and you have to run at the track person with a bloody knife. Oh and yeah, if someone the, and, this and, race has, is running. You better run yeah, faster. There's, it's, it's like an Olympic event, but there's two sides. There's the stabber and the stabby. And if you're the stabby, you have to outrun the stabber. But if you catch them and you stab them, whoever stabs the stabby first gets the gold medal in the stabber category, and whoever gets stabbed last or not at all gets the gold medal in the stabby oh, they category. Get the final girl uh, medal. The final girl medal, exactly. <laughs> Actually, that would be a really fun, uh, but that's just tag, baby. Just what? That's just tag. Tag, yeah. Yeah. But, like, for keeps, though. <laughs> tag, but for keeps. No, like, you use it to cram hole filler goop in walls? Yeah. No, no, honey. Like, I've never made a hole in a, in a wall before. Like, I know that your dad was just, like, electrician stuff and didn't really do drywall and shit. I mean, he like, does. He did his house. Yeah, like, that's... It's... Doesn't mean I was there for it, though. I mean, yeah, I know. Yeah. I've drywalled and spackled a house. Secretions, I guess. I don't know yeah. what you want from me. Like, <laughs> congrats. It sucked. <laughs> you have to sand that shit afterwards. You know, it's one of those things. It's like, I think given some of the stuff I was taught, and I say taught strictly because I did not learn these things. Yeah. 
I, I feel like I feel like dr doing drywall or something would have been like a little bit more up my alley as a kid. But mm -hmm. like when I was impressionable, yeah. right? Because I remember one of my first memories was my dad picking me up from school in second grade. And I remember I was kind of upset because it was Fun Friday and I got yeah. to bring my Game Boy. And I was like, Dad, I was playing Pokemon. What the fuck? And he's like, well, we're going to go shoot Pokemon for real, basically. Except they didn't <laughs> say it like that. He's like, we're going to go hunting. And, and, uh... And of course, you know, instead of teaching me, like, I'm not saying that framing a house is fun, but it's got more of an artsy vibe as opposed to, um, so shooting we're going to an animal. Well, no, it's not even just shooting an animal. It's like, it's not just shooting it. My yeah. dad, my dad is over here giving me step-by-step -step life lessons on how to bleed, draw, and quarter this animal for consumption. I mean, to be fair, I never learned that. No, I know, I but learned I, how to build I, things, I was too but young I to internalize to, like... it. All I remember is a bloody carcass hanging by its ankles. And I went, that looks really uncomfortable because it's the ankles. It's dead. It doesn't care. Yeah, look, that's how you know, because younger me didn't like younger me wasn't worried about the fact that it was dead or alive. I just thought that looks uncomfortable, and <laughs> and that's it. And that's it. that's the moment when I was just like, you know, maybe teaching me how to do some shit like like caulking or drywalling uh. would it have been terrible? Sure, it would have looked terrible on my dad's end. But but what's better? You can come at home covered in plaster because you did housework for a day, or come at home covered in animal guts. <laughs> And I was, I was like nine. I was like eight or nine. I feel like, I feel like hunting nine is like a little young for Oh hunting. my God. And you know like what it fishing, is? fine. My but... dad's heart was in the right place. Yeah. It was in the right place. But for my first hunting trip, he never, ever could have guessed what was going to happen. He never could have guessed that letting my younger brother go first and having him fuck up the scope would have caused me to, to have my first shot ever to, to, to realize that instead of just, you know, oh, it's quick, easy painless watch something just su suffering the most you could arguably suffer in your last moments you've been shot your legs don't work a strange man in overalls is coming back towards you after you assume he's the one that wounded you right it's that's that's some texas chainsaw massacre shit you escape with a leg cut off and as you're crawling away you see bubba just like oh you're not getting away <laughs> yeah, exactly <laughs> but honestly i bet you that's how it felt and it's even funnier. I just remember my dad. Yeah. He's like he tried. He, sh he tried shooting it two more times, missed, yeah. and then just says, "You and your brother look away." <laughs> and the last thing I see is him grabbing just the biggest tree branch I'd ever seen in my life. Oh, that's the last thing I remember seeing. <laughs> At least your dad didn't get like gored during that, because like sometimes people who are like, if you like, you miss the deer a little bit, and yeah. you go over there to finish it off with like a knife or something like yeah. that. Yeah. You can get gored by the antler. Yeah, like, yeah, no, well, know, no. So, so this is one of the things. It was a uh, molting season. Yeah. So the oh, buck, okay. so, so the like, buck didn't have its antlers. Oh, okay. Didn't have its antlers, so that was good. Yeah. And then my brother shot a doe because he didn't, because he, he was younger than me and yeah. I was eight. Yeah. <laughs> he was like five. So my dad just like, yeah, you want to shoot these? And my dad was trying to do his best, bless yeah. his heart. He's like, you know, you're gonna shoot the big one. And my brother's like, yeah, I'm shooting the big one. And he shot the fucking baby, uh -huh. but like. Size is relative. He's five at the time. <laughs> like to him, it was a pretty big deer. Right. So yeah, it's about the size of me. I think five-year-old him sizing up the deer. Like yeah, it's it's pretty big. I, I'm a, my dad calls me big man, and I'm pretty huge around here. <laughs> <laughs> no, <Nar, our> Bambi. <laughs> no, are you kidding me? It was Bambi's mom, really. Well, actually, if anything, it was Bambi and then Bambi's mom, <laughs> or I guess Bambi's dad, because it was a buck. Okay, by the way, one of the things that I saw that I thought was really funny, the Cass Vanderpaul, like, um, like the, 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 the Simba yeah. guy, you know, when he made the Bambi thing, I thought it was so funny that he made Bambi's dad, like, fucking ripped his shit. <laughs> he just had, like, a six-pack oh, yeah. of abs and was just, like, a fucking deer. Five-year-old some might say I'm a big boy now. Yeah, no, the second that you have to sit there and watch your father kill an animal and you're, like, <laughs> and you're, like, in elementary school... You've, I'm not saying you've grown up at that moment, but you are no longer a little kid. You have graduated. If you're in first grade, you're a second grader now, an honorary second grader. And you move up mentally with that group of kids, <laughs> which is why, which is why whenever I was young and this happened, I just immediately, whenever I, you know, I was in like second grade from that point on, you know, I was aware of what loss and death was I immediately upgraded to fourth grade. I, I would say each individual incident leveled me up as a, as a, as a child. I was a second grader, and then I, and then I tried shooting something that made me a third grader, and then it didn't go well. And my dad had to step in, and that made me a fourth grader. 
Okay. All right, I'm gonna go take that shot though so we can get back to fishing. Fourth grader, let's go. Yeah, instant tear ups. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna go into nauseam uh, about this one, but I think it's so funny because my one of my friends that we went to church with skipped a grade. She got to be in, uh, in second grade when I was in first grade, and I remember just being so mad about that. And and it's even funnier because my mom tried telling me like why I couldn't have this happen without being mean to me about it, and and she just tried telling me you couldn't do it anymore. But at one point slipped up and said, "I." And she's like, she's like, well, see, but with the classes you're in, you can't you can't really be doing that. And basically, what she means is you're with the stupid kids. There's no <laughs> skipping for you. Like you're with the dumb kids, 100. percent You ever wonder why all your friends are in the same class every year? Yeah. And you know what the worst part is? At first, my mom's like, well, they're all in the same class because you can't have me as a teacher in third grade. That was the truth. But then my brother had ex uh, accelerated math and got to have her as a teacher anyways, right? Mm -hmm. So they had to break the rules for that. But it was really funny because that it's like, okay, that explained it for third grade, but not for like the rest of my life. <laughs> my friends always had the same classes together. And I, was always in, I was always in a different class. And it's even funnier because... Uh, Aside from being handed the, the ADHD paperwork, essentially, in third grade, my mom just brushing that off, uh, the, the class I was strictly stuck with happened to be uh, the only friends I had in that class were the ones that were ADHD. <laughs> Go figure. And I only know this because they got the same paperwork that I did in third grade. You know, I really feel like my memory should have kicked in later. I don't think I should remember, like, any of this. You know, like, remembering algebra would have been sick. I think that would have been pretty tight. <laughs> okay, shot time. Then fishing time. I'm glad time is past.
Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Newt! I was gonna say, I ran back once I saw you from Milo's PC. I hope you're doing good. We'll be back in just a second. We're just taking a shot, and then we're gonna keep fishing. Don't worry, gang, that was me. <laughs> yeah, hang on, hang on. It just occurred to me that I forgot to do something. I'm basically back. I just forgot that, uh, I found out... Okay, expanded color range. And then it's on the PlayStation 5. I didn't realize there was a profile for capturing PS5, so I thought that was interesting. <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's Molly! How are you, Molly? I hope you're doing good today. I'm here. You're going to see me talking even though uh, it's Milo because the mixer just puts in like up to four mics. So technically, her mic is inputting is me. Sound is funny now? Oh, I know why. Hold on. Oh goodness, it did that thing again. What thing? The audio from the first time, which I didn't mean to I didn't mean to fuck it up like that, so we'll see if I can fixy fix. Oh yeah, by the way, before I do that, let me let me show you guys something. Okay, so I was trying to find a hat to put on, right? And I wanted to read you guys some of these 
Women want me, fish fear me equivalent hats. Uh, you got like, you know, fish love me, women fear me. Um, women fish, I fish, fish woman. I, that's a banger of a hat right there. <laughs> fish, wo fish woman, you say? I'm good, so bored at work and I caught the stream, thank god. Well, good news, we'll be live for a while doing dredge. So hopefully we'll be able to keep you from that workplace boredom. But, <laughs> soundless and maidenless, only for now. Worst case scenario, worst case scenario, if if push comes to shove, then I, I, I fucking forgot how I fixed it last time. But I just fix it the way I did last time. And then that's it. Okay, so. Let's see what else we got here, because these are some banger hats. So, I, I once I saw that, I stopped reading, because I was like, which... You know, like, there has to be better ones, right? So let's see what else we got. Women love me. Okay, that's just stock photography. Man, I feel like a woman. What kind of... This doesn't even have anything to do with fish. This has nothing... This has nothing to do with fish. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Is that an otter? Okay, honestly, down? though. Okay, honestly, though. If we... It probably is. But, okay, honestly. Here's, here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking if we did get... The fish woman hat we'd have to get it in the camo the camo is so stupid cringe, yeah. yeah yeah it's the most cringe for sure so fish want me women fear me see that's a good one this is like a render from like a video game or something i feel like that that's a hat that has been put on charboard that's uh, <laughs> it's like literally his fish too it has to be I a charboard thing be. right lucy loves me dads fear me who made this? Who's Lucy? Who's Lucy? Is I need she? This shirt. I need this. I need this hat. Is she a fish? Is Lucy a fish? I don't know. Fish fear me, my friends. <laughs> 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 oh my god! Fish fear me, my friends. Barely tolerate me. Oh, uh, I wish they. Let's see, let's see. Back, okay, honestly. hang on, hang on, hang on. Is this, is this a PNG? Please tell me this is, no, it's a WebP file. I bet fuck. you I can fuck with this, hold on. Oh yeah, here we fucking go, baby. All right, all right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's see, I just gotta pull up the picture here. Oh, here we go. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Hang on, it's gotta be, it's gotta be bigger. Yeah. Also, it's is it just me <laughs> or is in order to put it on right, it would have to be like <laughs> like if I can hear. <laughs> it's so stupid. Let's see if I can let me see if I can do this like in a, in a better in a better oh, way. way it, it's too, see it gets too big. It gets yeah. too big. How do you hang on? Hang on. I got this. I got this. What we gotta do is we just gotta. Yeah, there you go. All right. Hang on. Let's let's just. Yo, yeah. Yeah, that's working out. It, it looks stupid, though. It doesn't look like I'm actually wearing the hat. It looks like I'm wearing it like a beanie. That's a big-ass hat. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. How am I supposed to wear this like a normal person? I think my, my schnoggin is huge. Just put it, just, yeah, just put it like that. <laughs> just put it just like, right, just like right here. Yeah. All right. All right, oh, you know, hang on. We got it. We got it. Fuck, how do you line it up with a face that's not technically circular? Because I think it's more like more ovular, really. I think it's more ovular because it's fried. I mean, like, it's just not gonna, it's not gonna, it's not gonna look right. Cause, like, It'd be funny if I just, like, if I just, like, stuck it on the top yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> you just need a different angle of it. I really do. Yeah, you know what? Honestly, you know what you know really sucks? This is just, like, this is the one we have found of this exact hat. I mean, unless.
Okay, well, I hope they understand what I mean by heart. I don't think they understand what I mean by heart. Fish despise me, women tolerate me. <laughs> I, I wish I could just pivot this by like 45 degrees to the left. It would be perfect. What is this? Women fear me, fish fear me, men turn their oh, eyes away from one. me as I walk. No beast dare make a sound in my presence. I'm alone on this barren earth. That is my favorite hat and I need it so bad. <laughs> I like how this is quickly devolved from... I like how this is quickly devolved from me trying to find a silly hat to wear to the funniest fucking hat I've ever seen in my life. Um, okay, real question is... No, I don't think I could. I don't think I... <laughs> I'll try. I'll try. I gotta try. Who would I... Who would I be if I didn't try? No! It's a fake PNG! Damn. Alright. Well... I don't know what to do about this now. I guess we'll just either rock it with this or just go hatless again. See, this looks like this is just a beanie. That's what this looks like. This looks like a beanie. It'd be funny if it was, but. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay, how's that? Okay, maybe like a little bit further to the side. Okay, okay, Milo, give me your thoughts. What do you think about this one? You think that's all right? Yeah, that's what, found, what? I found it. I you found it. You right found right. it at an angle. Oh my god! If yeah. you cut that out, yeah, I will. I out. will put that on. Okay, Milo found the ridiculously big hat, but it's at like the angle we need. So we'll just keep this hat on until we can replace it with the hat that Milo sends us. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was working on this. I'm gonna start regularly updating the schedule. Don't tell anybody. They might start watching the stream. All right, so how do I cover this up again? I forgot. I have so many assets on this scene because I kind of work through everything with this. There we go. Perfect. Okay, I'm going to try my best to open this and have it not sound absolutely terrible. Uh, there is no guarantee that that will happen because I think that the capture card is doing the audio glitch again so let's and i say again it only happens whenever i open the audio software or the video software while i'm streaming but the problem is is that it happens <laughs> i don't remember how i fixed it last time all right brace for impact gang loud noise potentially incoming Noise is still fucky. Okay. Let me see if I can remember how I fix this. See, that's how you know I fucking opened up the software. The whole capture card shudders like that. That's not good. No. Oh, right. Okay, hang on, hang on. I think I remember what it was. I think it changes the audio encoder. Okay, actually, I don't even know if this is going to work. We'll see. Cute dog at work. What kind of dog was it?
Oh, what the fuck? How did I do that? How did I take me away? There we go. A poodle, but another breed. Ooh, that could be interesting. You know, I think my favorite poodle mix has to be Labradoodles. Not just for the name. I think they just look... They look like giant balloon animals. Like the little dog they'll make you. Okay, it's gonna flicker again. Hang on. Ba hold! Okay, I just changed the sound source to see if maybe this will fix it. Bob, if you are on deck, please tell me if this works. Did not- damn it! Worst case, I have to still- worst case, I have to reset something. That's like the worst case. I just would hate to have to reset stream. You know what I mean? So let's see, I'm going to switch it back and then try if that works and if that doesn't work. I don't remember what I did. I like how it cuts out my VTuber thing a little bit. I think that's funny. Just like a itty bitty bit of like a little stutter and that's it. Okay, last try, and then I guess if it doesn't work, I'll just, like, flash the stream really quickly. Or if I really want to make sure it works, I could just reset the PC. But I don't think that that's how it was fixed. We fixed it last time. I just don't remember if it was live or not that we fixed it. I can imagine having to go through the last... Oh, dear God. It was probably, like... I mean, we had multiple days where it was, like, 23 hours of streams... So we have to go through that and then figure out the exact time where it messed up.
Okay. Bob, are you here for this last try before I just have to, like, do a soft reset? Which it might have to happen, and that's okay if it is. I just wanted to try to keep the stream live. Yeah, you're here? Okay. It's probably gonna still sound bad, but I figured I would give it a shot just in case. Because I think the audio hardware just needs- or the software needs to be reset. But I think I need to, like, close OBS and stuff for that. Oh, uh, I might have gotten it hot. I'm trying to fix the audio. Yeah. Doesn't sound as bad. Might be fine. Okay, hang on. Let me listen to my... Thing. No, I think that's just the... I think that's just the... Yeah, I was gonna say, I think that's just it. Oh my god, did I fix it? Oh! Pog! Pog! Stream saved! Let's go! It sounds normal to me too. Anyone let me know if it doesn't, but I know what it normally sounds like fucked up, and it, that doesn't sound like it fucked up normally, so. Alright. Hang on. Let me get... Let me get the thing from Milo real quick. That's <laughs> such a big fucking hat. That's so funny. Alright. Save image. I'm just gonna put this on the desktop for now. Alright, alright. Hang on. Let's get the new hat in here. Oh my god. The hat is so big that I can hardly even close the picture. Oh my god, it's perfect. It's so... It's so tall. <laughs> it takes up so much of the screen. <laughs> I, I think you just have to leave it like that though. <laughs> It blocks the inventory, should we? It's okay, it's should... okay. No, it's fine. You That's... know what? You know what? Say say yes in chat if we need to keep it like this. Also, should I should I should I make it like No, I guess it's actually like the the, the no, size it leave, needs to leave be. It exactly yes, like leave that. it like this. Okay. <laughs> I can't. That's too good. Okay, fine. Fine. We'll keep it. We'll keep it. Okay, fine. That's why <laughs> You won't catch me arguing about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we're prepared for our fishing trip, everybody. I hope you've brought your alcoholic beverages. Uh, it's gonna be a, a trip with your favorite, I would say glucose guardian, but I have no money. Glucoseless guardian, Caro. Why It's not? gonna be like fishing with your step parents. All right, let's go ahead and get back to it. <sighs> I'm glad that I paused it because this entire time that timer would have just been going off. I don't think the timer moves when you're like holding still. Uh, no, it does. If you're docked, it does. Oh, okay. You know what's really gonna suck? I need to find more fishing games so I have like more excuses to wear this hat. Oh yeah, absolutely.
is this? Looks like there's no Aurora Borealis over these fish. Regular fish. Oh. I mean, I like it, but I I don't think I can take it anywhere for now. Yeah, I think it'll take you like a day or so to get back to your main town. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, it's going to take so long. There's some red light, though. What? That red light. Oh. oh. Yeah, Bob mentioned that those are there. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. You wouldn't? I thought those no. were the red lights no, that we need. No, the needed. red light that you need is that one that was sticking out. It's like a tall, like, fucking light. See it? Right there. Oh. Ooh, fish. Ooh, fish. Oh, gosh. Fish too big. Uh. You're just gonna drop it there. Oh, it looks like you can't fuck with it. We you can need the dynamite first. We might be able to, uh... Inspect it. Nope, we cannot inspect it. Yeah. Oh, uh, did you ever talk to the, the 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 town that's like right over there? I thought I did. It's those guys, I don't think right? I did. I think you just sold your fish. Oh, oh. See, those rocks definitely just pop up and weren't there before. I think it's well. The worst part is, I bet you it'll still sink your boat, but I'm pretty sure it's just because you're insane. Probably, yeah. You think it's rocks. Whatever that is sounded scary as shit. Yeah. Retired whaler. What is it? Heard you used to make explosives. Aye, I did. Sometimes the carcasses needed breaking up. What was it the most efficient? But it was most pleasant. But it didn't get the job. Oh, wait, but it got the job done. I can't do that accent forever. I, I, I'm not good at it. Um, <clears throat> Hang on, I'll give him a better accent. I've been thinking about getting back into it. Might be able to rustle up some strong enough, something strong enough to clear those debris piles in the cliffs. Uh, but I'm not sure. I don't have the energy these days. I have use for some explosives like that. All right. I'll think on it some more, but I'll make no promises. Anything else? Ah, la, 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 la. What do we got? What do you can you tell me about Inkfeld? Nope, that's it. Honestly, I don't really, I don't really have anything else I need to ask you. But that's it. He just said that he was gonna. I guess we just gotta go to the guy. I think you could probably ask again tomorrow. You think tomorrow? Oh wait, it's like daylight. You should probably go and sell your fish before they rot. Well, yeah, I just slept. Uh, so yeah, basically, he's just like, oh, you need explosives? Well, I don't really do that anymore, and I'm kind of tired. You're like, pretty pleased? He's like, I'll think about it. And then that's like where we're at. No, I think he'll like... Man, so much more money till I can afford the stuff that I need. I think I'm like halfway there. Let's see. The rod I need is 460. So I need 400, no, I need 200 more dollars. I'm really good at math.
Hmm. That narrow passageway looks a lot worse than the other one. The hat is hilarious. Oh, you, you like my hat, Darian? Come on, sit on down. Don't tell your parents, but you can have a beer if you want one. All right, we're getting there. One more day of fishing. We should be able to afford... Wait. How much can we sell this for? I know we can sell it. We'll have to go to the other, like, setting. I think it's the shipyard. Yeah, so that's 75. And that's already the 460 that we need. Let's go. So let's sell this. And let's sell this. And then we have 520. I wonder how they expect you to, like... If you sell your fishing rods and then run out of money, I wonder how they expect you to, like, recoup from that. Alright, here we go. Flexible fishing pole. Coastal and shallow. Perfect. Now, we just gotta get 460 more dollars. 410. 410 dollars so we can get the, the oceanic one. Making bank. Oh, you know how it is. Like I said, it, it, you know, when the fish fear you, it makes the job a lot harder because they're actively running away from you. And that's the biggest problem. You completed the hundo, so I'm big chilling. Nice. Good job. I don't know why completing the hundo sounds like a milestone for selling like a lot of drugs. Dear goodness, wreckfish. That's a big boy. For sure they fear the infamous hat. <laughs> When this, when that's when the shadow of this hat is cast onto the water, the fish scatter. You know, it's really funny. I don't know why they have, uh, what's it called? the time, I guess you could say. Like, uh, you know, like, they, we're out here for like, we're on day 12, you know what I mean? And uh, the only reason I'm saying I don't think that matters is because as far as I know, I don't think we have a deadline for anything. I mean, it's nice, yeah, it's nice to mark the passage of time, but it's like, we don't, as far as I know, I don't think there's like a, you know, be here by this day. So it's just like, it makes me feel like I'm like not doing something I should be doing, there I think is the biggest like thing. There might be like something that happens later, like you have to have been doing this for so many days before like a certain event will happen. Yeah, that's possible. Oh, I bet you it's like that. Oh. 
Oh boy, I got a book. Thanks. Now we gotta go back out. We got like two more trips of fishing to make before we can even afford the coastal rod. Also, coin! What's up, tiny boy? I love how you're giving them like, uh, like people coming to watch. He's in here to watch you stream. Do, tiny boy? Yeah. Hey, one tiny boy, welcome into the chat. How's your day going? What the decaying black mouth? Okay. Uh, yes, it probably is sick, honey. <laughs> Damn it, still no dredging. Aw, oh, dang it. Okay, uh, we'll replace this one with the crazy one. Oh, oh, it's dark as shit now. What is that? Okay, good. I, I don't think it entered the hall. It would have told us. Yeah, it would have told us. If it entered the hall, I would have gotten so much more worried because I'm pretty sure that those worms are not something you want to, like, sell to a successful Caro Con. Wait, what? Are we cheersing? Are we drinking? I could drink. We're fishing. Fishing and drinking go hand in hand like fishing and drinking. Oh. Man, so close. You know what? We're gonna go... We've kind of fished this area out, but I think we're gonna go around the back of the island. I unleashed a bunch of emotes onto the stream. What? Also, if anything, the driving is just really big. Also, I think that's the first time anyone's ever done big drive. We are big driving right now. So that's all junk. I mean, it's really cool that all this is junk, but like we need it to be fish. It's a lot cooler if all this is junk. Oh shit, sick. A waterfall. What is that? 
What is that? That is something you should get the fuck away from. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm trying. No, go, 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 go. Oh my god, go. Oh my god, go. Oh my god. Oh my god, go. I wanted what was in the middle of that lake. I wanted what was in the middle of that lake. It's not happening. I bet that thing in the middle of the lake is is a. Oh my god, do not stop. Oh my god. I bet that thing. Is it still chasing me? No, it stopped. Okay, good. So I bet that thing on the middle of the lake is what you need to give to the old man. The fish? No. The thing that was there. Ah. Uh... You need a much faster boat before dealing with that, and you can't dredge it up anyway. Oh, it's a dredge? Yeah. Never mind. I mean, wasn't it? I thought it was just something I could pick up on the surface of the water. Oh. There may have been one there, but like, um... You aren't fast enough to deal with that thing, I think. No, I'll get the Assmaster Pro 5000 outboard boats, or outboard boat motors. Or whatever the fuck is necessary. Oh, hey, look, there's more gold over there. Damn it, it's dredge. Oh goodness, no. Now is not the time for this. Not a lot of expensive fish. The perch is worth three dollars. God, that was the perch was literally worthless. anything that would warrant spooky music. <laughs> dissident chord <laughs> dissident poor fuck I can't remember it. Dissident chord progression. Heavy use of strings. Oboe. It's all quite ominous. Controller rumble, and I thought I heard something. I don't know. I mean, it's definitely spooky right now. Is that? Oh my god, it's that boy. <laughs> Welcome to the dusty pontoon. How tough are you? So he leaves that area. So there's a potential you could go into there without, like, alerting him. Uh, and or it's just an event. Ah. Alright, shipyard. Give me that coastal shit. Nice. We got a thing called feeling prepared now.
All right, well, we don't have any coastal stuff we need to get right now or oceanic or whatever. So we'll go to here, talk to that guy's brother, see if he has anything to say, visit that other town. And we're technically here to find another guy, but I don't think he's here. Yeah, I think we may have gone far. Or the wrong south. No, it was definitely south. It can't be the wrong south. Well, like, south of the place is different than just south. That's true. Oh, wait a minute. I'm curious about something. It looks kind of... The color grading just looks kind of off on my stream to me. I wonder if my nightlight is affecting this. No, doesn't seem like it. Oh well. I'll have to figure it out later. Unless, like, something like the color space is messed up. But I'm not gonna do that midstream. Not again. We've already suffered too much. Ah. Hello again. What can I do for you? What am I supposed to be doing? You were to keep an eye out for uh, the family crest. I already knew that. Okay. Wait. Large waterfall. Yep. Yeah. His family crest is definitely inside that thing. Or it's in the middle of that. Ugh. Okay. You know what? I know you said I needed to be faster, but I did outrun it already. I guess I could see if it's grabbable. All right. Wait, what? Oh my god, what? He just came out of the hole. Yeah. I don't think he's chasing you, though. He can just come out of any of these little holes. That's that fucked up. Hopefully. Oh, that's okay. Okay, this is nerving. I'm about to lose my first boat. Nope, it's a dredge. Shit. I hope it saves whenever you, like, sleep. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was just here. Okay. Ah. Alright, we're leaving this area. Oh, that was so messed up. I missed the trophy fish, but I also didn't know if I had to throw on the top one. Because, like, throwing changes, like, what you have to click on. And I didn't know if, like, clicking on it would have also changed it. I'm guessing that giant lighthouse over there is to signify the island I came from.
Okay, that just looks like fucking Stonehenge. Let's go that way. Killer whales! How exciting. It's nice to see regular creatures sometimes. Guide me, fellas. Easy said you look like Doug Dimadum with the hat. It does, right? Is that a demo problem? I really wish that there was a tall version of it where it says, I'm Doug Dimadone, owner of Dunks Dugsdale Dimadone. Doug Close, Dimadone, owner enough. of Dugsdale Wait, Dimadone? What, the fuck? what is what is this? Oh, uh, that's when you're crazy crazy. See your eyes uh like brown. Great. Yeah, it's uh it's time for you to make it to port. Well, I'm trying to make it to port. I don't know where a port is though. Yeah, uh, right now you probably can't see where safety is because when you see, I think what Bob said is when you see those little eyes sometimes you can't actually see what's safe. Now's not the time for that. Is that light? Uh, that looks like light over there. Okay, let's go that way. It's almost daytime too, so like, you'll be fine. And see like, now your eyes red, you're like crazy crazy. Got that ocean madness. Wait. This is just where I came from. Oh, you turned around. That sucks. No! That's it. I'm selling it before it can infect the rest of my fish. I'm gonna have to just sleep through the whole day. I got a long way to go. All right, this time instead of going that way, we're just gonna go north. I think I can get this now. It's oceanic. Let's go. That's a big chonker. I wonder if you can get upgrades to, like, make stuff last longer. I mean, hopefully, like, a refrigerator. The shape it's of this shape of this fish is bullshit. That sucks. It 
so if you're in front of a buoy, you can use it for safety, right? Yeah. Okay, that's what I thought they'd said. I just wanted to be sure. What, babe? Oh. You approach the hooded figure, swathed in Hello. dark blue robes, their faces barely visible. Fisherman, please, help. You can barely understand their raspy voice, whisper, uh, ray, oh, you can barely hear above their ray, rasping whisper above the wind and waves. Fulfill the hunger. The hooded figure unfurls an old paper scroll. They point to a shape, and it appears to be a blue mackerel. Okay. I think that's that dude that, like, went insane. Yeah, he wants a blue mackerel. Is Are no, those here? No. Nope. That's a flounder. Hey, okay, maybe that's the island I was supposed to go to. Because I, I think the island with the lighthouse is where we came from. There's something here. Oh, here we go. Here, it's the guy. Okay. The man is standing in the doorway. Yeah, I was way closer. <laughs> Watching you approach, he's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. <sighs> you came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things. Art and artifacts, treasures and truths, and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. You give me the handkerchief. To, you, oh, you give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. These patterns are unmistakable. Even after all this time, this handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance, as you can imagine. Retrieving them is proving to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your- Yes! I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge the wrecks in the dark depths. Find me these lost relics. And I will reward you in ways beyond your imagining. You need not to give up your fishing career. I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make necessary alterations. What do you say? <laughs> An excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. Yay! The relics we're looking for. A ring, a necklace, a watch, a music box, and a key. I would encourage you to ask around towns about shipwrecks and other strange occurrences that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Okay. One second. Okay, it's a locked workshop that looks like it hasn't been used in decades. Alright, let me see. What am I supposed to do with that? I can't roll. I just thought it was funny. You, you gotta have a beer with your hat while you're fishing. I mean, you could have just done like a can of beer. I could have. I mean, let me see. Let me see. Let me see if there's a way I can I can just yeah, like yeah, yeah. add it quickly. <laughs> it looks like it looks like it's being handed to Kara. Just like here you go. 
All right, hang on, hang on. Let's let's see. Where's the? I thought it was funny to use like a realistic, like human hand instead of actually drawing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on. Let's just let's just. There we go. That looks natural. Nice. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Okay, let me let me just lock that real quick. You know what the worst part? Hang on, I gotta move these down because as of right now, they are going to be over all of the alerts. All right, glad we got a beer chat. Let's just go ahead and and we'll we'll sit here for a second. Cause uh, speaking of beers, I think I think I'm due for another shot. So I'm gonna do that in a quick trip to the bathroom, and then we'll keep fishing. Milo, do you want a shot? Yeah. Alrighty, I'm back. I wonder what the, uh, if the wind means anything or if that's just where the wind's going. Uh, it's gotta mean something because we didn't have wind sparkly. this entire time. That's what we need. 
No, that's not what we need. <laughs> Look at his eyes. It looks All like all-seeing cod. It looks like the fishmonger from our town had uh -huh. sex with that in order to create it. <laughs> I like the all-seeing cod. That's great. The cod-seeing eye. Cod-seeing eye is just like a witch's eye that like you used to see only cod. Ooh, look at how much fishing we have to do here now. Yeah, I think uh, I think that's like the move is going away from here sometimes and then just coming back. So I know that um oh my god okay so we're gonna have to come back for that. Um yeah. but yeah the the lighthouse is really interesting because I think you can see it from the whole map because mm. uh, like I saw it from all the way over there and I think we're close to like the border. I want to say that but I have no idea. Don't forget to not sell your cod. Right. We'll do it like this. Oh, wait, that's rotten soon. So yeah, sell it. Ah, uh, oh well. Fuck. God damn it. I literally was trying to not do exactly that. Can talk to two people before I'm we gonna leave. talk to them in a second. Okay. Since we still got a bunch of daylight time, mm -hmm. I am going to get the crabs and then hit up the big fishing that I saw over there. Well, we can't pick it up for. Oh, yes, we can. I guess we'll go to big fishing later. We gotta get this crab trap. Because yeah. I think this also needs repair. Yep. So many crabs. Fish with deformities. What do you think happens to a person that eats a fish with one of these? Oh, fuck it. Oh, you just <laughs> clicked something. I didn't mean to do that. I was trying to finish off his sentence. Damn. Well, perhaps. I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish. Any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Have you got any of the mutants with you now? I think I do, actually. Aha. This tiny crab. Fishmonger takes the aberrated fish from you. He clutches it to his chest, wringing it around, uh... <laughs> wait, wringing it around its slimming body. Yes, this should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth, and why don't you take these two? They're of no use to me. Nice. Whoa, that's huge. Hmm? You hear that? Sounds like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. Oh, he's insane. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please, sell me what you leave. Fuck. Please, sell me what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature quickly. Okay, I know he meant, like, quickly now, and he was gonna, like, yell it and be all dramatic, yeah. but that's kind of creepy. A little creepy. The fishmonger's door slams behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. All right, a little bit creepy. Oh, we gotta go across the river to talk to that guy. I forgot. I have to give a ring to somebody. Volcanic what? and shallow. 
more mangrove and coastal. Hmm. This kind of sucks because... I would just hold on to them and see what engines you can get. I was going to say, like, and then this is like all of them. Yeah. So it's like, it kind of sucks to have to like pick one just to... Yeah. But if you look at the progression tree, that's like the only way to get here is by doing one of these. Yeah. But uh, since we don't haven't ever gone to any of those new places yet, I don't think that it matters very much. I think improved engines or better crab things. Okay, well, let's research engines. Mm -hmm. I keep accidentally hitting square instead of X because I'm used to doing Xbox. Alright, so now you can get a engine slightly better than your starter one and the one the other one. Nice. Uh, what about the nets? You haven't looked at those yet. Uh, don't have the option to look at nets. Uh, okay. So, what's the difference between that, like, mm, several thing one? Jet drive engine. A relatively new design, this unit propels water through the system more efficiently than outboard propeller setups. Uh, nine knots. Oh, plus nine knots. <sighs> I guess whatever you think is ideal after this. I mean, the worst part is none of this is ideal yeah. because of how big these rods are. <laughs> well, like, and also, like, we don't know which one we'll find first the volcanic or the mangrove because you haven't found any either of those right and what also sucks is uh the oceanic mm -hmm. is just so massive it is so massive so we but need I to think, upgrade it to do more rod slots i think what you're doing for the most part is switching out for whichever one you're gonna need because i think your storage is like the same for each of the islands yeah, I guess if you're in one area, I'll just yeah. keep the research part on. Actually, I'll put it in my storage. Yeah, I think that would be a good move. Okay, and then technically there's a storage at the Jewelry Guys Island as well, so we'll put that there. And then we gotta go to the shipwright to yeah. fix our crab traps. Alright, how much does it cost for... Improved outboard engine, which is 15 knots compared to our current... Which is like 12 or something like that. 14 and 10. Yep. That really sucks that it is hardly better. Yeah. But it is slightly better. Okay. Okay. Well, let's get rid of the rusty engine then. Oh, yeah. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out at the sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? I'll say it's peaceful. It's peaceful. It's gotta be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I just think I need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward. Moving along. Uh... Oh, excuse me. Choking? <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. Alright, it's so bad here. She's gazing out at the sea, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move. I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need, and I can make a new place for myself. You'd be welcome to visit too. Just stack it up at steel point when you have anything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Ugh. 
Also, I didn't ask, but Darian, what'd you get for an alms? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? She eyes you suspiciously. There's a spot near the back of Greater Marrow, where the current carries the wreckage from the sea. Some nights you see an unnatural glow rising from the patch in the dark water. Can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. She's the Harbinger! Yeah. <laughs> Remember, what you put in the ground isn't the same thing that you dig up. Alright, we need to find that noodle did you boy. fix your things? Fix what? Your crab cases? Yeah, crab traps are okay, fixed. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, let me, let me put those back up. It's almost night time, by the way. Yeah, I was just gonna fish the, the bay. Hmm. Yeah, so I'm gonna start far out and then just make my way in. Oh, a lot of the fish just stopped because it's night time. Yeah. Trophy squid. There was some glowing water over there. Fucked up eels. Finally, fucked up eels. I don't think you can fit that in there. I thought I had one two slot space. Nope. Well, shit. <laughs> Wonder if that's where I'm supposed to go. I think we can still go there in the daytime, right? I don't know. They might have said it was strictly at night. What? I can't sell the fish? Um, I guess sleep, uh, sleep and see if you can in the morning. Ah, oh, fuck. Who am I supposed to sell my fucking fish to? <laughs> alright, alright, I guess we just gotta like speed run this and go to that dredging area. the shit that's right, crazy that cool? huge skeleton huge skeleton okay so that's just off by itself we don't have any bombs yet i don't see the light anymore unless it's in that pool by itself oh uh, you only see the light at night i oh uh, <laughs> i asked that but i guess i didn't hear if you answered oh Well, this sucks. Was that evil whacker? Uh, no, I think it's thunder. Alright. This sucks. Where else can I go? I mean, that one place is so far away. You know what? There's that one chick that said that we need to go to the north for that other place. Maybe they have a fishmonger.
It doesn't really look like there's even a town here. She called it like steel point or something. This might not be it. Oh. Yeah, it's steel point. This is, you just put materials there, nothing else. Wow. I'm sure you can like talk to her later. Ooh, Italian bread. Oh, I bet that's delicious. We got to figure out about what we're going to do for dinner. Because, <clears throat> like, I'm, I'm definitely getting to the part of snackish at this point. That a little boat? I was gonna say I don't know what that is. Yeah. You pull up alongside a boat with uh, at an anchor. Let's see. There are no signs of life on board, or there are signs of life on board, but nobody appears to greet you. Call out. Almost immediately, a small snot. Snot. God damn it! A small slot in the door snaps open. It, a pair of frantic eyes peer out at you. Who goes there? A fisherman. What do you want? Just checking to see if you're okay. Do I seem okay? No, I'm very much not okay. I'm supposed to be delivering this package to little Mar uh, little Marrow, but I'm being stalked. A huge leviathan is lurking in these waters. I've seen it. It, it hung in the water. It's gaping mouth. Just below the boat. I would have swallowed this vessel whole if I hadn't bolted for the shallows. I'm not going further into this accursed chain. I could deliver the package to little Marrow for you. Mm. You would? Well... That would work, I guess. Oh, it's big. I think no matter what, you're gonna have to chunk two fish for it. No, the fish are getting stale. The courier pushes a lumpy brown package through the door hole. It squelches slightly and you take it into your hands. Dark fluids ooze from one corner. Thank you, stranger. This is bound for a dock worker at Little, Mar uh, Little Marrow. I know exactly who that is. Not sure what's inside, but listen, I know this sounds crazy, but sometimes I think I hear the faintest whispers coming from it. Now, I'm not supposed to be transporting live goods. I uh, don't have the equipment for it, so just be careful with this thing. Whatever it is. Here, why don't you take this too? Again, an item emerges from the door hole. This time, a book is pushed through and it thuds below. You pick it up. I'll be on my way whenever the coast is clear. Safe travels. Oh shit, I guess the Leviathan gonna be after me now. Could be, yeah. Well, good news. I have dual outboard motors and I'm a total badass. I think that's Little Marrow right there. Yeah, I think the Little Marrow. Ooh. Oogie. <laughs> nah, I'm alright. Thanks, though. Yeah, I think Little Marrow is the one without the big lighthouse. Cause that's like no, the yeah, the big there. lighthouse is... You don't have anything you can do. Like, you don't have space. I know I don't have space. Thank God. Ugh, blinding headache today. Did you come by yesterday? I don't recall. Anyway, what can I do for you? Take that, take all that. I 
I think you still have a cat. Or does it just tell you all the time that there's plenty? Uh, hey. No, it's missing. Never mind. Yeah, I was gonna say, no, we only have two crab traps and they're both out right now. How's the day treating you? Got a package for you. A delivery, eh? Oh, it's a big one. Let me see. He takes the large package and examines it gently with his hands. He lifts it to one ear and listens for a while. He seems satisfied. Much appreciated, friend. Now, if you'll excuse me. Wish me luck. He turns and hurries off the dock to, uh, without another word for you. Or compensation. What? <laughs> that bastard. All right. Painter. Ah, the fisherman. I thought you might stop by. Welcome to my humble studio. If you're wanting to experiment with some decorations, yes, I'm the person to talk to. What sort of decorations? I can attach flags and bunting and add some style to your boat. I have uh, a design I already might think you like. If you find any others on your travels, bring them back to me and I can rig them up for you. Of course, I can also add a splash of color to your hull. I'm sorry to say that my selection of pigments are limited at the moment, though. Mm. I... Okay, so he's thinking about how to make new pigments, and he's mentioning that he saw a strange crab. My knees aren't suited for clambering over rocks and chasing crustaceans, you see. But if you caught such a creature, he clears scraps of cloth and paper from his workbench, revealing a large pestle and mortar. With the right binding agent, we can grind them together for a new mixture. He turns back to you, a cunning plan formed in his mm. mind. Fisherman, bring me some of those strange crabs. We're turn you will turn your vessel into a work of art. But for now, what can I help you with? Sharp makes like that. Mm. Oh, I like it in blue. Oh, that's nice. Kind of weird that you can't change the bit that's white, though. Mm. Mm. I don't know what bunting is. I guess I it's the tires. Either. Kinda, I was gonna say green looks kind of weird. All right, let's see. Cause blue looks nice, but I don't know. The red's kind of cute. Let's see. All. Hmm. Hello. Is everything okay? Do you know of any shipwrecks around here? Well, yes. You see, my son was lost at sea some years ago. He's still out there, somewhere, in one of those wrecks, alone in the dark, cold water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to maintain composed, but tremors of grief rack his body. I was wondering, I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve my, any of my son's belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. 
He wore a bronze metal belt buckle. Specially engraved. Uh, you'd recognize- I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Is there anything else I can help you with? Nope. I know about the strange occurrences. Fucked up squid. It gets dark so fucking quickly when it you really finish. Does. I mean, think about how long it takes to actually fish normally. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Big ol' load of squibs. Oh, there are different kinds of mutated squids. dollars per crab trap? Nah, I'm alright. You have like 500 doll hairs though. Yeah, but it's fine because like I hardly checked the uh, the other ones. Mm -hmm. The crab traps are probably good things to do if you're planning to just like dredge the whole day. Yeah. And you still want something to sell at the end of the day. Speaking of... So, we gotta go on our first dredging mission. We should just yeah. do that right now. You wanna go to that uh, that red light yep. in the background? That's what we're gonna do. Assuming it's not cut off from our access. Yeah. Although, well, the way they talk about it all the time, I feel like it's gotta be, like, approachable. Uh, unless they expect us to have, what's it called, the bombs by now for some reason. Mm, I don't think so, because, like... I don't think we were supposed to be all the way over there yet. Okay, no, it was just further this way. The rocks are so scary. The rocks are scary. Oh, what the fuck? It's a person. Are they ramming you? They're coming for me. Oh, it's an anglerfish. It's a fish? Yeah, that wasn't a... I thought that was a boat. Dredge, start dredging. Oh, uh, I think it's getting me. Oh, are you supposed to dodge you're supposed to dodge the things. I get it. Thank god it's daytime. I think that's the only thing that saved me. Oh, a weird big ass fucking big ass key. key. Yeah, you're super insane now. You should probably go take a nap. Milo's advice for the insane. You should take a nap. You're hitting the... Oh, fuck. No, my hydraulic rod got damaged! Thought I'd have a good stream. Hate myself that's play Overwatch 2. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry to hear that, Shoji. Well, hopefully you at least win. And yeah, thank you for stopping by. We're just gonna- we're gonna be fishing. I hate that it doesn't upload me on mobile so I can see what people are yeah, saying. Yeah, I, I feel bad because I- I couldn't see for a second. I- like, my phone is not in the most viewable place whenever I'm playing, like, consoles. I do the best I can. <laughs> okay, I know that I'm, like, insane right now, but what if I did some fishing? I mean, you could do some fishing, like... You're not likely to get murdered right now.
I wouldn't say to do it right now, but you do need to take Mackerel to the creepy hooded figure uh, living out on an island by themselves. That's true. I just gotta remember which way that island was. I feel like they would appreciate a fucked up one, though. You think so? Yeah, that well, seems like a... So that just, seems like but, creepy but the word mackerel was in like on. blue or green instead of like pink, you know? Maybe, maybe. So where do I get the? Where do I put the key? Um, I don't remember. I forgot who that. told me about. Oh, uh, I think you have to give them to the dude uh, that you gave the handkerchief to. You think so? Because it's pink, right? Yeah, it is. It is. Oh, right. We oh, should... take a nap. We should sleep. Like, your eyes are not spooky scary right now. Okay. So he was slightly to the north, so we need to go left and then find the house. It's just, it's just like the single house. Was he over there? He said his he said his was to the north. This is or south. Oh. There it is. I remember because it we went way too far in the yeah. wrong direction. Or not no, the right direction, which we went way too far. You have something, don't you? Show me. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers. A strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head, somehow changed. Smaller. Has it always been this way? Is that all? Where's the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems the piece we're looking for traveled further than I anticipated. Much further, I suspect. In that case... Allow me to aid your travels. He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision and you stagger back briefly. Now go. We have more relics to uncover. We have haste. Otherworldly speedy at a price. My intuition tells me that the current may have carried some of the debris southeast towards Gale Cliffs. Make sure that is your priority. I'll mark the location in your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? So he's I like, want to ask some questions. <laughs> I'll ask him later. Okay. Well, that doesn't mean that you get the options to ask him later. We'll all be right. all right. Look, he, he's, he's like right now our, our, our relationship is casual. Increases panic and engine heat. Select it with L1. No, I'm not going to be using that unless I really need it. Um, but no, he said northeast, right? I don't know. I think he said northeast. Well, fuck it. Let's go check. So it was north or southeast. But I, think I think he said towards Gale Islands, and I think that that's where cliffs. you were before. Yeah, yeah I cliffs. think the cliffs are where we just were too. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just let's just go there. Because there was dredging there to be done. Sick. Oh, you know what? It's fine because Gale Cliffs has the merchant that does repairs. What was that? I don't know. Field trip canceled. We're catching fish and then repairing the hull. I don't trust whatever that was. My controller rarely rumbles, and so when it does, that is very concerning. Blood skin shark.
Ah, uh, those are some big boys. I'm trying to go for these guys. Oh, that's what we need. Okay, we gotta save this one. We need two of them. You could go try to put them away before, uh... Before leaving. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put them away, then I'm gonna come back. And then I'm going to... Sleep. And fix the boat before heading out to the, uh, what's it called? The cliffs. wave washes over the fish, sweeping them away. When the water recedes, you notice something lodged against the rock. What the? A handline reel wrapped in a length of stretchy sinew. One end is grafted to a crude bone hook. That's sick. Okay. Why can't I just put it on board? I don't know. Oh, it says you can return to these items later. Okay. Wait, so does that mean that every time I put more carbs here, it'll just... I don't think that's the case. It's, 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 it's received its offering. So I wonder why I can't take this though. Uh, because it can only go in one of your uh, fishing slots. Because it's a fishing thing. Ah, there we go. Oh, sick. I was like, I had to be able to take it. Just because I can't equip it doesn't mean I don't have, like, a floor to throw it on. Oh, you know what? Never mind. I should have tried to put in more of the bent fish now that there was nothing in there. You did. You couldn't. No, no, no. I tried it with the, uh, the fish still in. Oh. Or not the fish, the prize. I knew what you meant. Okay, why do they keep telling me to try haste? Uh, probably just to see if you can do it. So like, you don't forget that it exists. <laughs> the lighthouse keeper fuck the key of the lighthouse the lighthouse Keebler. Keebler elf <laughs> yes that's what she is i was making cookies and i heard you pull up in that that jalopy that of jumpy yours. At, that junky ass boat uh, the lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town she walks towards the dock with a confused mm. look on her face oh it's you who were you spectating or sorry who are you expecting your engines it sounds like i'm sorry i mistook it for the vessel of an old friend dejected she walks back towards the lighthouse. Oh, that's kind of sad. I'm sorry it ain't me. A fucking expensive ass fish. Got 300 bucks from that. I'm sure it was that shark. Yeah, or whatever it was. Plus two rod spaces. God, there's so much shit we need for that. Yeah. Have you even dredged anything yet? 
Uh, uh, well, the first thing that we did, yeah. But mm -hmm. that was it. Nothing, like, actual material-wise. We should probably do that for the next day or two. Yeah. Force yourself a week, you know. I know. I wanted to go during the day. Fair. Not only do I gotta dredge stuff on the way to where I'm going, but I'm traveling towards the cliffs, and I know that there's at least two things I need to dredge, dredge. there. Oh, right. Finally. Oh shit, that's right. Yay, weed. Oh. Hitting stuff is the worst. We could only find earrings from that. <laughs> oh. Oh. I want those. Hmm. Big guy. Yeah, I was going to say, what a unreasonably sized man here. I think I'm just gonna let him go. There. I need space for wood and stuff. Also, fuck, it's already goddamn four. If only turbo boost didn't make you insane. Oh, wait a minute. She needs a wood here. <laughs> it's your lucky day. There's some more over there. You can also just rest at this dock, so you don't even have to go back. Yeah, I think I'm gonna dredge everything in this area here and then sleep. Oh shit, I should've just realized that's not the move. Nice! You need that to do boat stuff. So you can dredge more. Oh, jeez. There's more over there. I was gonna say, it's already so dark. Yeah. <laughs> I found a golden chalice. Oh, really? Is it the... Fuck, what do they call it? Is it the Holy Grail? No, it says... Little... John! What? Who is that? I haven't the slightest idea. Must have been a king. Hmm. I feel like I'm in- yep, oh. in danger. Yep, exactly. Well, time to take a nap. Meow, my sleepy time. At least I don't think that damaged your hull. It did. Oh, it did? Yeah, you can see it. It'll oh, say I see at the, the top. Oh, I see the X's now. 
Oh, where are the X's? There and there. Oh, yeah, in the actual inventory. Poles. Yep. I was gonna say, I saw two things say that shit was fucked up, and I was like, great, because now I gotta go all the way to the islands, and I hope the traveling merchant is still there, because she might not be. That's exactly what you need for that builder. I was gonna say, oh wait, let me get the Oh no. I lost some of my metal scraps. Get the metal scraps, finish that lady's building, and then we are going to go back because we cannot make it like this. Shit, fuck. I don't know why I did that. There's so many metal scraps in that pile. Well, that almost paid for all the damage we took.
Oh, I forgot to let the builder know. Shit. Ha. Damn it. Okay, I'll go back. Let the builder know. Wait, no. There's one thing I'm doing because I'm already here. Grabbing the rest of those metal scraps. It is 11, by the way. PM? Yeah. Oh. Thank you for the time check. Do we want to eat something soon? Yeah. Okay, me too. I don't know what though. What an awkward guy. I guess I can just only fish up one for now. Yeah. I think the builder was on the main island, so I'll have to check there. Yeah, she was on the main island. Oh, he's big and awkward. He is big and awkward, isn't he? You've done it? Well, no sense in wasting time. Let's get moving. <laughs> oh, you gotta put her on your boat now. Good riddance to you, Greater Marrow. I'm onward bound. After a quick sleep on my boat. Alright, so like I'm a fisher first. And a taxi second, so just uh, if you'll excuse me real quick, I'll just yep, take some of that. <laughs> Sorry, you decided to transit on Crab Day. Oh, it's broken. Yep, we'll fix it later. You know what? I just want to be a huge pain in her ass and just start catching fish while we're moving. Like, ma'am, can I have you uh, lift up your foot here? Yeah, thanks. Yeah, we have a uh, fish we have to put there. It's just company policy, really. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop her off. Then we're going to move on to the cliffs, sell the fish we got, keep fishing, dredge, and then get bitches. I mm -hmm. think that's the plan. Yes, yes, this'll do. Thank you, fella. <laughs> and give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome back anytime. She reaches into her toolbox and pulls out a handful of components. Take these. Always good to have on hand. Oh, we have to put I'd them on put us. i put those in those dead zones. Oh, I know. It's. I thought I could just put them into, uh, what's it called? Storage. Ah. I think it's around here. Which and then this way. The yeah. Stonehenge looking thing? I think it's the Stonehenge looking thing.
That's fancy. What? That thing there. Also, uh, you should get. Okay. <gasps> <gasps> yeah. I heard the noise, and I was like, something doesn't feel right. It sounded right. like a helicopter, right? <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Creepy statue figures. I hope they let oh. me sleep here for the night. A man meets you at the dock, bracing himself against the wind and spray. Oh, rapturous day. A flesh disciple carry me atop the waves. Come ashore, weak thing, and rest your weary soul. Just passing through. Nonsense! Your arrival is provenance uh, from, the leap, from the deep itself. I have been calling, and now you are the answer. The rifle purification is almost at hand. You are to be my replacement. <laughs> Listening. <laughs> Your trial begins immediately. Tell me, what does the spirit see? Happiness. Ha! Merely an excuse to halt the search of something greater. Happiness is by definition a compromise. And your flesh, what does it crave? Chill of the water. I sense it in you. A glimmer of what waits below. Finally. What does the world deserve? Everything. In a way... It deserves to be- oh, it deserves all that is washed ashore, freely given from the deep, but no more than that. The trial is concluded. You still have much to learn, but that knowledge will be delivered to you in time. Now, your role as my initiate is to act as the Herald of the Purge. Ah, yes, of course! Judge as I was- Just as I was oh, sorry, for judge, the one before me. Just as I was for the, for the one before me. Okay. Oh, gosh. The nearby spirits blaze with eternal fire. What? Spires. Spires? Fuck me, I cannot read this. Yeah. This font sucks. I probably should have my glasses on for this, honestly. The nearby spires blaze the eternal fire, yet the stone hearths of these three idols are barren and void. Retrieve the three fathomless flames from the crags behind us to ignite the cubicles. Crucibles. Whatever. <laughs> cubicles. Just light a bunch of office workers on fire. Fuck it. Who really gives a shit, you know? <laughs> Visit the shrines of the deep. I will mark them. They will offer further guidance, and I must provide no more. Okay. The stone columns of the temple are carved with ancient pictures and text. What carving do you want to look at? Carvings of a large fish with crossed out eyes. The unseeing mother. When the starving cannot eat, she approaches. Beneath the beneath these words, somebody has etched a crudely scratched note. Blind, but can hear her children. Avoid at all costs. Oh. The stone columns of the temple are carved with a yeah, hang on, it's a bubbling vent. The breath of salvation burns those that mean harm, only the pure remain. Beneath these words, somebody added a crudely scratched note. Protection, follow the magma, find them. A carving shows a swarm of small fish surrounding the boat. A raven the ravenous children. Alone, they are nothing. Together, they summon her. Oh. Beneath these words, someone has crudely scratched the note. Do not let them grip you. Burn them away. So I guess we have to kill a bunch of shit to come back here. Mm hmm. Hmm. Weird. The blood red air hasn't gone away. Yeah. A little concerning, though. You know what's even more concerning? I don't think this is where we're supposed to be. I don't think it is. Oh uh, yeah, you see there's magma here. I don't think you can do, do any fishing. Oh, this is volcanic fishing then. Yeah. That's why it's all red and hellish. There was a bottle over there.
this guy is weird. No kidding. So I think in that zone, the bubbling vents offer protection. Whales! <laughs> offer protection from the fucked up things that are there. And it's probably like, uh, kind of timed events where you wait and you go and you wait and you go. Okay, so if I remember correctly, I went the entire way south the last time yeah. that I got lost, so I think it's over here. Yes, I remember, because I remember looking to the right and seeing those ruins. A dolphins! Finally! But, hey, I heard y'all like to have y'all's dicks out, is that true? And they just respond, but it's in dolphin. It's like, I don't really know what I was expecting. Oh, there's no. Is that what that is? I assume that's what that is. It looks like snow. Look up further. Nah, I don't see any snow on that. I was gonna say it's still raining. Yeah. I guess it's just a little fucking whale. Lights. Maybe that's the one. If it's not, we are in deep trouble. True. Also, next time you see the anglerfish, try turning off your light. Next time you see it, leave it on for now. You'll go insane faster. You think so? Yeah, I think that it's attracted to your light. Oh dear. I think you need to run. Do haste. Oh, you're about to overheat. Oh, hey, buddy. That's how you know we're going the right way. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't think you're gonna make it. You just destroyed both your engines, by the way. God damn it. You could have hung out there in the shallows until morning. You think so? Yes. So I don't think that the big scary fish can get you in the shallows. Yeah, it seemed like he couldn't. I, I guess I was just like focused on getting to where I needed to. Oh God, we're so far away still. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I guess just go directly that way. Yeah, no, we just gotta go hella south. Heck, okay, since we have to go so far south, would you like to drive the boat? Mm -hmm. Thank you, because I want to get up and stretch. It's just forward on the left stick. Yeah. All right, Milo's our captain for the moment. I am being relieved. Do you want a drink, honey? Uh, what? Like Ow. a shot? Yeah, like a shot. Yeah. Okay, I'll set that up. And then also, uh, I'll look in the, the fridge and see if what we have for, like, food, food. Okay. Whale. Uh, single.
Oh my god, fuck. Fuck you, bro. Time doesn't pass unless we're moving. Fuck. I you have damaged inside? the vehicle. Okay. That's the mobile. Ooh! Doesn't, doesn't matter. What? I ran across a, uh... Mimic? I guess? It was a downed ship and I was like, ooh! There's like this downed ship over here. Like, that looks like something you're supposed to look for. Uh -huh. And then it got up and hit me. That's crazy. Yeah. The old fashioned anglerfish by the sounds of it. Well, she's seen the anglerfish. It no. sounds like she like saw something different. It was something different. It was like if a hermit crab lived inside a boat. It was like if a hermit crab lived inside of a boat. <laughs> well, you want to take a shot before we begin our adventure again? Sure. All right. I went directly south from here. Well, that's what we did last time. Well, I, I didn't go to like... Yeah, no, I know what you mean. That's what we tried to do last time, was just go straight south. Um... It seems like that guy is inevitable to run into, but it seems like to what degree you run into him just kind of varies on where he's at when he notices you. Yeah, that's the case. If the hermit crab thing could Oh, you would have totally made it, because, like, then you would have had an extra hit to get to the dock. But yeah, okay. Next time we'll... Not next time, but, like, we'll get back in just a second, and then we'll get there. Just, just, just hold on for a second, Junior, while I get another beer, all right?
it that way. No, I can't. Because I'm terrible at remembering shit. We only have what? Colby? That's fine. Yeah. Um. That is really funny. That time stops passing. I guess. I guess if you're not fishing, it's not passing. Or maybe it passes like. What if? What if you sit still and you're not fishing and time passes at a one-to-one -one scale? <laughs> It'd be so maybe. fucked up. Okay, uh, give me one extra second before we get started, and that, or well, started again. We've been streaming for a bit, but I just wanted to make sure I'm good to go, stretching and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, just give me one more second, then we'll get back to it. Fuck. What crying? Oh, that's when you died. Well, oh. you, well, you or me, one of the two.
I'm on a boat. So, I guess because everything has to be official to some capacity, now that we're back to the, uh, the normal stream schedule and stuff, some things have changed. Um, I mean, obviously y'all know about the sub dice, but also we had hit the ADHD diagnosis over Carocon, thanks to, to one person in particular. <laughs> um... So, I don't know. I mean, I had a hard time thinking of what to do for the replacement for the dono goal. And so it'll be a stretch and it'll take a long time. Like a long time. But I want to try to upgrade to a better graphics card. And then, you know, if it's good enough, I might need a slightly better PSU because my current one's 700 watts. But, like, not like a 4090 or anything fancy. I'm still thinking 30 series, but it's just, like, I don't know if I would want a 3080 or a 3090. But just to, like, help the smoothness of the stream. And maybe then we could also stream in 1080p, and that would be sick. Some random bozo for real. Yeah, we nobody knows to this day who it was. What's up, honey? Um... No, you could just yeah um hey yeah, just make sure you creepy I like the chicken sandwich is crispy oh okay good but yeah anyways just wanted to say what the new goal was it's gonna take a long time but I don't know I'm gonna count whatever I have left over from like subs and stuff as well. So hopefully just with enough time we'll get there. <laughs> That's where we're supposed to be going. much gas I tried I tried not giving it as much gas how much will the goal be so um I have it set really like not really high so I, I have it set if we went 3090 route as opposed to 3080 because they're like it's the more expensive one but that plus a PSU is like 1k I, I explosions you mean explosives yeah. well hang on let's 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 go here first and then we'll just come back that's not that bad. You say that's not that bad, but it's one of those things where it's like, I feel weird, especially, uh, you know what it is? Every digit that any dono incentive has, the, you know, you add like an increment of how bad I feel for putting it up there. Cause I wish I could just afford this kind of shit. Rough bud, but not too unrealistic. You know what? If you want to see the cleanest stream we can have without getting just the most top of the line, ridiculous shit, you know, something that you could say is upper middle tier or maybe even low high tier, right? I mean, it's still like, it's still a great graphics card. I think, I, I, I think all 90 series have like 24 gigabytes of onboard memory, which would be so much more than we're currently working with. It just sucks whenever we stream and occasionally stuff lags because I'm working with eight gigabytes right now. And that's just not enough for some games sometimes, let alone streaming like hell, like streaming hell divers out of the question right now. And I would like to change that, because, like, I you know, like games. 
I like games a lot. I like to keep I like to do, keep doing more games. But yeah, so that's the idea. The worst part is though I got to figure out I got to figure out ways we could try to like make it fun at least. You know. That's like the least thing I like to try to do is if we try to do something, you know, for like a goal, try to make it fun. <sighs> oh, the rod. Oh, the misery. Everybody wants to close my fishery. We don't have storage here, so let's go to the- Oh, you yeah, there it is. There it is. Okay, cool. I wanted to put- Wait. No, wait, wait, wait. We'll just do an upgrade. Research, baby. What do we need? Four? But we can't even put stuff into it because we gotta do the- Okay, I guess we found volcanic, so we'll do volcanic first. We'll just not make it. And then we'll- Yeah. Wait. We have to do both. You have to? Yeah, it doesn't let oh, you put me lame. into this. Okay, no, if anything, this is great. Because now if we get one more, then we can just say fuck it and work on doing this. Uh-huh. Unless getting more research parts would be easier from making these. But the biggest problem is, I mean, I guess we'll just see because we have a shipyard right here. Or no, not right here, right here. Mm. How much do these cost? I bet you it's not great. $330. It's actually not terrible. I expected worse. Yeah. But we also need the actual upgrades to the ship that allow us to have more ship to our ship. Yeah. I honestly wouldn't bother getting the uh, the volcanic thing until, like, you've just upgraded it to where you can get the dual one. Right. Because I want to get... I want to install this. Yeah. Uh, but the biggest thing is, is that we need to do... Can't replace them. Ooh, lights! Ooh. Two hundred and seventy-five dollars for these puppies, and but, it's eighteen hundred lumens. But you can't fit them. What do you mean? It's two slots. You only have one slot for your lamp. You're right. Oh, you know it's funny because it lets me highlight one at a time. I thought they were li like two, mm -hmm. but the brackets are connecting. Damn. Lamp. Well, glorified lamp, really. 350 for this. So $700 and I would get both the research parts. I don't think it's worth it. I think Are you sure? Find those. Yeah. Because, like, we could immediately go and get. You could immediately go and get it. Yeah. Well, like, no, no. What I mean by that is we could take these mm -hmm. and then start working towards the multi purpose rod with only three more left. And, like, while it would suck to lose that much money, the ship is in great condition. We could just fish the local waters. Yeah. I guess if you're going to hang around here for a little bit, it doesn't matter. I think that's the main thing. I think that's Because that big-ass stingray is fast. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we need three more for that. And then when those are done, we can do this. And it doesn't seem like, it seems like we have to, like, these aren't connected. So I don't know what we have to do to figure out what this is. I don't know. I think you first have, disco have to discover Abyssal. Oh, we could have gotten the 25 knot motors. Yeah. I forgot about the other tabs. <laughs> it's fine. We don't even I have I assumed you were just like, didn't care at the moment. No, it's not that I didn't care. It's that I genuinely forgot. Oh, okay. I think there's some stuff you can dredge, though. Yes, no, it is. This is where they wanted us to go. So mm -hmm. what's going to happen is it's nice and early in the morning. Let's check our inventory real quick. We're yeah, completely them. empty. Uh, oh, yeah. Upgrading. With They don't have a yeah floating dock. That's what yeah. it is. Okay, so two rod spaces. We need two wood. Oh, a cloth and a bolt. Okay, hang on. Yeah. We'll be able to figure I that out. I think the only thing you don't have is the bolt. 
Uh, actually, let me look at my storage because I have these. Yeah. Oh, I guess those count. Those are the, those are it. And then two of these. Because I would like to be able to equip this random hook. I don't know what it does, but there's nothing wrong with an extra two. I believe it's rod slots, right? Yeah. I mean, I assume it's rod slots. Yeah. Okay. Weird that you can float dry dock something, though. That's kind of unrealistic. <laughs> The thing went beep. Oh, okay. Look at that. Just enough. $95 for the upgrade? Sure. I know that we could do some trawling over here. Oh my gosh, so I hadn't mentioned this, right? So my mom, uh, she messages me and she's like, hey, there's this 4K TV that they're trying to get rid of at my work. They used it for a convention for three days. Do you want it for $100? I was like, I mean, I do, I do but I don't have $100. I was like, so you should probably pass on that, right? You know, I, I'm not gonna like ask people to buy something I can't afford, right? So she goes, oh, it's okay though. Uh, I picked it up for you. Just let me know when you have it. And I'm like, no fucking shot that she actually decided to do that because it was so cheap. She's like, I couldn't pass up the offer. And like, damn it, I'm so happy because I, I didn't care. I would not care about 4K TV, except there's one thing. It's the size, if not bigger than the TV I currently use to play my consoles on. It's 4K, meaning that the the PlayStation 5 could output in 4K, which it's native for, if I had the TV, because this TV's only 1080p that I have on, and it still has Roku. <laughs> but yeah, so point is, is that I'm gonna, I don't know, I, I, I don't know if it's, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be in the area and like, for a doctor's appointment at some point soon so i'll have to see if she'll let me pick it up but i almost feel like bad like i almost feel like i should have the cash in hand if i go and pick it up you know what i mean so i'm gonna see if i can just just nickel and dime my way towards things i think i have like three weeks so i might be all right welcome back milo so sandwich oh thank you i was wondering i was like i could munch so what do we got what do we got uh it's three o'clock. Oh, fish. I was going to sell my fish. All right. Already making the monies. I know these are dangerous waters though, so I gotta make sure I don't get too careless. Nice. Oh shit, nice, apart. Jesus Christ, it's so foggy! Ah. Hmm. 
Yeah. It just sucks because I already put, I could have had a better motor if I didn't put it into the rod already. I mean, I do kind of want the 35 knot twin prop engine. That does seem kind of neat. Looks like we are good for now. Rest. <laughs> Rest and then sandwich. be trawling we need to go this way from spooky uh -huh. oh yeah <laughs> gonna wait for a better engine maybe <laughs> i just know that there was like other things that i could dredge Oh my god, what the fuck? I wasn't even trawling for the valuable. A house? Yeah, we're definitely going to be respawning this. Oh yeah. I fucked that up. I don't think I have any fish. No. Oh, right. All right, I'm gonna give it one more shot. It makes you insane when you do that. Damn it, it's coming. I went the same way again. I think I gotta go further back.
That's not what I was looking for. And one of the engines is broken. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> so, um... I found a message in a bottle. Wasn't, uh, wasn't the item I was trying to go back there for. Oh. <laughs> also, one of my engines is damaged. Unsurprising. That seems, to be, that seems to be one of the first things to go is the engine. Yeah, but what I did was kind of fucking stupid. I, I hit it on something. Uh-huh. Yeah. You got a notification on Triangle. I'm trying. Oh, that's the boat. Oh, heaven. Ah. Uh. All that flavor text you ain't never gonna read. I mean, if I do, I'll read it all at once. Get some flex tape for it, if only. Flex tape actually work in this universe. That'd be actually a really funny mod for the game. I need money so bad right now. Well, that sucks. Yep. Oh, I would have gotten rid of the fish. Well, I'll just go sell the fish. Weird, twisty little guy. I have to say, it's so fucked up to me to see a salmon that's like an ocean salmon. I was so used to seeing river salmon. I didn't know that there was two different kinds. No, they are the same kind. Oh. So like, ocean sh salmon are like how they are before and river salmon are spawning salmon. Okay. They just get a horrible, ugly transformation when they get horny.
Oh man, spicy chicken sandwich was so good. <clears throat> okay, but Darian, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta level with me. How fucking funny would it be if you rolled up to one of these places and it really, it really was just like Phil Swift and he was a ship, right? <laughs> The traveling merchant worries me. I want to know how often she travels. Right. Like, does she stay here? Does she go places? Is there a way like... for me to, like, um, find her? <laughs> Do you have enough garbage to make a new thing? What do you mean? Do you have enough garbage to make a new thing? A, a new thing? Like an yeah. upgrade? Yeah. Oh, let's check. Yeah. Oh, it's that one. Okay. Yeah. Um. We could do... Oh, plus two engine space, actually. Oh. Because you for real need to get to an upgrade where you have more hull space. Yeah. Hang on, let's see what that takes. Ah. Yeah. We have to get all of this first. Yeah. How much does that take? We would need one extra wood. Uh huh. And then. Then you uh, could have brighter lights and make maybe uh, make things not like fuck with you so yeah, much. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. So let's just put just put this back for now. Go get a piece of wood from. It's got. There's got to be somewhere around here that has a piece of wood. Right. This is gonna be one of those moments. It's just gonna be, we're gonna fish anything that we see, whether it's living or inanimate. <laughs> we need money that badly. Dealing with the giant monster definitely uh, hurt the wallet. Also spending $700 on upgrades. Upgrades, people, upgrades. You can organize that one better. I'm just gonna go sell them because we're right here. Oh, okay. It's like, it would be, I don't know. It wouldn't be terrible for time, but it's already 5 p.m. and we caught those five feet from the place where you sell the yeah, fish. Yeah, you might as well sell them and then like take a nappy. Yep, that's what I'm thinking. And don't forget to go Betty Bye for your sanity. Bonjour, bonjour. Hey. God oh, damn it. Doc, hey. no. No barking. I don't know what happens whenever you touch those water spouts, but I'm afraid. This is a new one. Yeah, that's a new one. Sturgeon! Fucking oh, weird. Oh. Why is the game depressed that I caught this fish? <laughs> I hate how wiggly they are when you flip them around. Yeah. It is kind of funny, though. This Tetris is strange. 
Yeah, fish Tetris, definitely the definition of this game. Oh, there's that wood. Please don't let anything bother me while I'm doing this. I felt my controller vibrate. Now I'm scared. No, fuck, stop. Now I'm fucking this up. They got me nervous. Well, your screen's not red, so you're fine. What is? Put that oh, over there. upgrade part. Sick. Yay! Weed! Alright, let's go do that upgrade real quick. Are you going to? and two bolts and then one wood and two like canvas <clears throat> well I'm at least gonna go apply those bolts to something you could also put a new light on yes I'm gonna do that More of her sale. Ninety dollars for the light bulb? Damn, that's not bad. Perfect. Nice. Engine. Oh, you know what we could do? Oh. oh, we don't have the money for it now. Damn. What the... You're looking at your core pursuits. Yeah, I just didn't mean to, I guess. Yeah, you must have accidentally pressed triangle or something. Finally, headlights. <laughs>
You know, I think we're on the wrong space for like the, you know how this place is named something cliffs? Yeah. I think that we're in the wrong area for one reason. Why? I'm pretty sure the area that we think we're in uh, is supposed to be, what's it called? I think it's supposed to be northeast and not south. Oh. Well, because I, I think I remember them saying that's what direction it was supposed to be. What are you looking for? Well, we're looking for a dredge area that's like got one of those highlights, like the you know the red highlights. Oh yeah, I think the the wind is leading you towards it. Oh, you think so? Yeah, the sparkly wind. Probably purchase another upgrade now. Holy shit. Yeah. <gasps> Careful. Okay. What the fuck is that? I don't know. Whispering. That's all I know. I think it increases your madness. Shit, I blew an engine. Yeah, see how high your madness is right now? I think that touching that increases madness. Go figure. Oh, just leave that in your pocket. See what you can put it in. Uh, I, just, just for the sake of feeling safe, I want to put it here first. Okay. Look, I almost died with it. Also, I want to take inventory, because there was more than just this. So, two wood, three canvas, and a necklace. Two canvas and a wood, so we can do net spaces. You should probably make sure your boat's repaired before you do anything like that, though. Yeah. Twenty-five for that upgrade, Jesus. Now I just need one more scrap of metal. I thought I had it all at first.
Oh, we can't afford the upgrade. Oh, well. Hmm. Alright, it's fishing time. Because, like, materials are good and we have plenty, but we need money. You keep accidentally, like, pressing that button. I know. Oh. You don't have room. I was excited. It's scrap metal. You might be able to fit one of those. Two probably. Two, probably. You can probably get that upgrade now. Oh, yeah, you're right. Let me circle back around. Yes. Now we just need three canvas, two scrap, four wood, and I don't know what the thing on the right is. And it might be a blueprint. Oh, gosh, I hope it's not a blueprint. Mind my asking, the two fishing rods on the right, don't they do the exact same thing? Coastal and shallow? And the other one? I think so, yeah. I thought maybe they just stacked the effects, so maybe I was getting like slightly better fishing, but you're probably know. right. Like I just didn't really dedicate too much thought to it. might get a little bit better fishing speed. But it's like 1% now yeah. that I look at it. Yeah, it's not great. I was just thinking it might be a good way to free up a little bit more space on your, on your boat. But yeah, I'll, I'll put that in storage. That's a good idea. Like, if you put away the big one that's definitely taking up more room, it might take you way longer to fish a uh, coastal. But, like, you'd have more room. Uh, hang on, hang on. So the big one... Here, let me, let me show yeah. you. The big one is oceanic. No. 
The big, big one is, but the long one is. The, the long same. one is. Yeah. Hang on, hang on. Here, I'll show you what it is. Yeah. Uh, where is it? It is storage. Go to. So we need to get rid of this one. Okay. Because it catches coastal and shallow, but the thing is, the fishing time is plus forty-five mm percent -hmm. with this one. Ah. Uh, I think that you could put that one back on when you're really trying hard to get an aberration, because it looks like there's a bonus for catching weird fish. This one? Uh-huh. So you yeah. have an aberration bonus of yeah. point, over uh, 1.5. I guess just uninstall. Okay, so let's put this back in storage. There, yay, now you have enough room for like one more fish. <laughs> Hooray, fish room. So now, those two slots for the outboard motors fucking suck. Yeah. So what they want you to do then is... Oh wait, I think we need... Hang on, let's go to the other thing. It's... Yeah, we need one more. We don't have 350, do we? I don't think we do. No, no. we don't. Uh, wait, no, fine, whatever. Oh, well. I meant to leave. Please stop now. My little brain, huge, true. Glad you added the cat mouth for non talking. Well, you just, like, like, just looks like a lot better, I guess. We also edited the, uh, the blinking to, like, I guess be more stylized is the best way to put it. Less more. But yeah, I like the cat mouth is fun, but I like the little, I don't even know what you'd call it. I called it a mud kit mouth at first, but that is not correct. It's not. It's a, um, oh, motherfucker. It's the motherfucker mouth, what she <laughs> it said. It is a motherfucker mouth. But, um, Clod Sire. Yeah, it's the Clod Sire face. Yeah. That's what it is. He's got baby face. Big old case of dumb baby face. Yeah. Oh yeah, I don't know how likely it'll be just because of the efforts involved with doing it, but we might also, uh, well, we're going to add emotions. We just, I don't know if we're going to do it with this program or not. We're, we're still ironing, ironing out the kinks for that. We'll figure it out. Ideally, I'll have expressions at some point though. It reminds you of Catbug. I don't think I've seen Catbug. I feel like that that's a deep, like... That's what? like an old thing. Catbug. Just because it's an old thing doesn't mean I should know it. Yeah, it was like a... It was one of those YouTube uh, cartoons. Oh, no, definitely didn't see it if it was on YouTube. Yeah. It's weird. Couldn't figure out what made it. It almost sounded like one of the animals was in here and went like really grumpy about something. But mm. I looked over and there was nothing. I thought it was uh, the lady. Oh, it might have been. Okay, let's see. What do we got? What do we got? Loading dock. Oh, dang it. I knew it was too metal, but I didn't want to overpack. It's honestly just... Oh, wait, baby, stop. What? Click on that again. Wait, hang on, hang on. I'll go back. No, no, no. No. Click hang on, on it. Hang on, hang on. Don't, I... don't, don't. Trust me. Click on, click on the floating dock again. Okay, click on that. Press R1. 
Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. I didn't realize it was like that. No, okay. I saw that. And I was like, oh, no. We're doing this the fucking hard way. We're doing this way. the slow and bad way. <laughs> uh, let's see. Always down to watch big gaming, but y'all don't have to go to bed soon, right? No, tomorrow's Sunday. Yeah. Tomorrow's Sunday. We did a lot of our normal cleaning up yesterday. Yeah. We're just going to be, like, touching up the house tomorrow. Why do you want to play Phasmo or something? Is this what's going on? Because, like, I'm willing to compromise. Are you wanting to be a part of big gaming and not watching big gaming? Alright, so let's see. What do I want to do next? <sighs> How much money do we have? 248. I'm chilling, watching Dredge. If you want to play something, I'm also chilling. Boat game go hard. Boat game actually do go super hard. This is probably the most I've enjoyed a game in a while. And like, it's really funny because every time I mention it, I want to just be like, and I and I can't thank Glob enough for the PS5. But it's like he knows. I gotta stop sounding like a broken record. But yeah, no. I honestly, it's you know one of those things. I think I'm having a lot of fun because I'm looking at a TV, talking with Milo about it, mm -hmm. and you, of course. But just like sitting here chatting about the game, playing it with a controller that's not, you know, too short, and because it's wireless, obviously. Yeah. And then I can see everything, and I mean, it looks great, feels great. Oh, speaking of uh, Bob, if you're curious, because I'm trying to be more consistent, PlayStation Day is going to be on Thursday. So we'll be continuing Dredge on Thursdays. Mm -hmm. uh, I might edit the time. I might be going, uh, you know what? It's one of those things. And since we're doing PlayStation day on Thursday, I think what we'll end up doing is, I, I, I think it's one of those days that I set for a 5 p.m. start time. But if that's the case, I'm, it might, it's probably just gonna be like a long stream day in those cases. Cause I could see myself sitting here for a long time and just enjoying the, the PlayStation until the controller runs out of batteries or some <laughs> shit. <laughs> That's a mood. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Speaking of, um, so Monday, Minecraft is still on the agenda. PlayStation Day, we got Dredge. Uh, Vex has requested Detroit become human, which I slated for Saturdays because they gave me a shot. Uh, or a choice, really. Saturday, we'll do random games. Um, let's see. You know, it's funny. PlayStation Day is the only thing that doesn't start at 5 at the moment. Oh, hang on, hang on. I'll have to, I'll have to edit some of these times, but... It's funny, I, I would just put a static time. You know, I'm just gonna put five for everything. And if I'm not live at five, the assume that the live times are gonna be time between five and eight. Cause you know, if if you know if I got nothing to do and we're waiting on someone to get home like Milo or whoever we're playing games with, then I might not be on at five. Uh period, Detroit become human OMG. Have you played it before? No, haven't. I've never had a PlayStation. It's not on any other thing, I don't think. Maybe PC, but if it is on, on P PC, now. if it's on PC, I don't have it. But I think it's a lot like, uh, I think it might run on run like garbage on the PC or something. I mean, it's it's one of those things. Hypothetically, nothing runs garbage on the PC with quotes. It just depends on what PC you're playing it on. Yeah. You know, and also, and for the record, I'm not saying that's an entire truth either. Some things do be running like shit on the PC. Ports, ports cough, are notoriously cough. bad in that regard. Oh, you know what? No, I'll just put five, and we'll just we'll just probably be closer to seven on that day. Um, I just don't want people to think I'm stupid late all the time. Whatever. That's one thing I, I don't like about the the Twitch schedule. You can't just say every Monday shit at some point. You can say that you don't know how long you'll stream for, but you can't say. You can't say, well, I don't know when I'm going to begin. I'll try to make it more realistic to, like, the actual time, I think. We'll, we'll put six. That's what we'll do. So, um... What was it? Me and Milo also got to figure out what we want to do on Sunday. Because that is, in fact... Caro and Marrow Day. I suggested the next... Uh, Saints Row. Which is, which chronologically, which one is that? 
Chronologically, it's Get Out of Hell, but then after that, it's uh, the one where you're president. I mean, I do want to be president. Okay, so Get Out of Hell? I think that one's single player, though. Get Out of Hell is single player? I think so. I think you're just Gat. I've never played it, though. Saints Row Wiki says Saints Row Get Out of Hell is two player co op. Oh, okay. Sick. So I guess, right? Yeah, I guess. Oh, hey, baby. Yeah, what's up? Uh, I need to go on a dog walk. Okay. Oh, uh, I guess quick question. Bob, you want to play some, some spooky, scary ghost game? Because we could just stop here for the night. We have been streaming for five and a half hours. Sure, I guess. Hell yeah. I hope we can get Darian on board because there's a there's the weekly event going on right now where you get no evidence for the ghost. You have to guess what the ghost is by like using other clues. And then, of course, if you do it three times, you get five thousand dollars. Are we gonna wait till Milo gets back for fast mode? Yeah, we can. We'll probably just chat until then. Uh, yeah, I heard you. So you're not just walking the dog then? I mean, I, I would. It just depends on how long you want to keep Bob waiting. <laughs> yeah. Well, yes, but you being like we're we're trying to like you know, I don't know how long. Oh my God. Okay, fine, whatever. <laughs> you, you 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 give me you give me a headache sometimes. <laughs> No, I know, I know, it's fine. Just, just go ahead, go on your walk, go on your walk, honey. <laughs> go on, get! <laughs> Dredge it up, streamer, honestly. This is gonna be what happens. We're gonna, we're gonna be playing for a little bit longer, I guess.
Oh, I see what you mean by uh, the face looking like cat bug, by the way. You just check the Discord DMs. If she's coming back for Phasmo, then I'm gonna go take her her mic.
All right. It's just me now. All right, we're going to go do some uh some quick fishing. Some patrolling for some items. Hopefully not get into any trouble. Welcome back to boating school. Oh jeez, thanks. I call you Miss Puff because you smoke fat. Haha. -ha. But uh, what was it? We are going to be doing this until Milo gets back. Then doing Phasmo. I don't know if I'll stream Phasmo. We'll see. I might try it just to see how it looks because I have not tried to stream Phasmo since. I'll just I'll refer to it like a traumatic experience. The incident. And the incident was them not optimizing the game for years. Accidentally hitting X. I hate that. Well, not. Nah. Damn it. <laughs> Darn you, PlayStation, and your different button layouts. It's not X, it's square. We're slowly but surely making our way into the market here. So, let's see. We have the exact 350. We should probably fish for another day before trying to do anything stupid. Because as much as I would love a brand new outboard motor, I don't think that it's going to help us out in the short term. You know, it just occurred to me there's an inconsistency with this town story. They're having me fishing because they needed to eat, supposedly, right? They've said this in the beginning. That's why that guy opens his fish shop all the time. Is he buying fish from other people? Like, I don't give a shit, but how are they feeding themselves while I'm gone? <laughs> Wanna seem ungrateful, but more metal scraps? We needed that. Oh, sh okay. Uh, we're just going to leave this here.
Oh, I thought we left it here so we could like come back and get it. I guess it just actually throws it away. Let's see how much these twin prop engines cost. <laughs> Brace yourselves. Oh. oh my god, just one twin prop engine is four. Well, this is gonna suck. I feel like I inadvertently just got the wrong engine. Four fifty. And right now, my current power is 29. It had to be a block. It had to be a block of four. The biggest, the biggest question is, do I do it? Because if we break one motor on a dual motor setup, it's not as bad of a situation. But if we break the one motor on the one motor setup, it's an arguably worse situation. Also, did this not say do it's twin prop? Where is the second prop? Damn it. I wish Milo was here for me to bounce this idea off of. I don't know which is better. I mean, it's nine power output more. But who the fuck can stick engines on one slot that doesn't exist yet? We'll try it. We'll try it. Oh, good. Okay, they don't let you sell this one. Okay, good, 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 good. So... What the fuck? That was... Okay, Google. Stop. That was creepy. <laughs> Don't do that, Google. You scared me a bit. Oh, wait. Okay. Two hours to install an engine I own already? Oh, I should have installed the... Wait, I couldn't have installed the other one first. How am I supposed to... I don't want to lose two hours of my life. To... Oh, to storage. It, you just have to press... Tri okay. You, have to the... you just gotta press triangle. It's fine. get it and put it into storage okay so uh it didn't let me sell the engine you start with which is a great redundancy plan amazing redundancy plan so i put it in storage 
because I think it even measures, uh, measures, God damn it! I can say words, I swear. I think it even measures, uh, the speed that you're doing in knots, so it might be slightly faster than just, I think it was, it was either six or nine miles, in, or, uh, knots, per, like, it's knots instead of miles per hour. So that is what I'm hoping will make a difference. Kind of afraid to go that way, honestly. I still got a dredge for that one item. I kind of want to scout it, but I know that the closer I get to that thing's hideout, the more on my ass it becomes. Damn it, I missed the trophy fish. Okay, that's red. Oh, I didn't have any space for this. Well... So, immediate impression of the new engine. It definitely seems to go faster. You can kind of notice there's like more of a wake behind the boat now. But do I believe it'll get me out of any sticky situations? Maybe. Maybe I think about maybe a solid, solid five, maybe six out of 10 on the confidence scale. Not that high though, because everything seems huge in this game. Still increasing is good. Yeah, you know what? I think that's one of the reasons why I couldn't discount it entirely. Like, the sense of speed at least is there.
we were waiting for you. We're just chilling. Also, boat game. You're snuggled with a cat right now, <laughs> LMAO watching boat. Yeah, that is high key chillin'. But no, I like the vibes boat game has. Wish that the music wasn't only whenever I'm here, but I guess that it just kind of adds to the uh, ambiance. The fucked feeling, if you will. Man, while I was right, stuff stacking in this game would be the shit. I know that's like the whole point of this system is to like for it to not, but it'd be real cool if it did. Okay, $285. Let's check our upgrade tree real quick. Jet drive engines. Okay, we could get two of those. Twin jet drive engine. Holy sh... So, oh, it even... Okay, so this is two... Okay, so no matter what, the engines were going to be huge. So five research part will give us the jet drive engine, but we'll definitely try to get this rod before then. And then okay, so that means that this rod is a six on like the bigness. Oh, we have nets now. Oh man. <clears throat> We're gonna have to go home if we're gonna do that. That way we can get the, uh, that way we can actually put them somewhere we're familiar with and then just kind of stack it there for a couple days. Um, so look at this, we figured out that it kind of just shows you how big the engines are, but that means that these ones are huge, right? <laughs> Except this, but this requires a lot. And 18 more knots would be crazy because we can fit two of these on the current boat. Because we have this with two with uh, one slot on each side at the top. But yeah, we're gonna figure that out. And the thing is, hang on, where's? How can I see our setup? Yeah, so we need one more slot here for fishing rod to get the big fishing rod. And then, as you can see, this would be where we put those little turbines. Well, at least that's the plan right now. So, we'll have to figure out how to do all that whenever we get there. Uh, oh wait, basic trawl net. We know how to do this. $250, you are out of your goddamn mind. Alright, you ready to play Phasma? Okay. If you want to go get set up, uh, I'm going to at least try to stream it at first. Yeah, just to see, uh, just to see if I can. Yeah. Yeah, I can play it finally. Yeah, no, I saw you do that and I was like, oh, no, you can take that. It's fine. All right, so we don't need to. I don't know if we need to save to sleep, but it's 6 a.m., so I'm assuming not. Saving. Oh, there's a saving quit menu. Nice. Hey, 
<laughs> okay, hey, hey Bob, I got a question before we get in the call. Should I just leave the character like this for the Phasmo? Should I just should I just leave the hat for Phasmo? <laughs> OMG, yes, might as well. Okay, yeah, yeah, no, we'll definitely just leave it like this. I just looked at this and I went, I, I could take it away, but like, why would I? <laughs> why would I? T why would I take that away? <laughs> 